Right, okay. We are back today. Deal with more problems. <laughs> This horse kicked me as I walked past it. Telegrams. We're running. Strolling takes too long, and I'm just really impatient as a human. Oh, sorry. Right. No, I don't know why I came in, but people know we are up and around. About and in Valentine. It's easy. Howdy. So many times that you have to do this about and in Valentine. Oh. And then we want actually I telegram in debate because I still want to talk to Doc about something. Actually, the wife. I think I've got everyone in the group there. Mike working in there, I hope so. Is my mic working at all? It is. Okay, we're good. 
wouldn't be wrong or out of place with that be technical difficulties. Right, so today I actually want to work on trying to build up the civilian aspect around the manor because we've got our guys doing crime. We really need that front to kind of protect them now. And at the moment, the only sib we've got is Indy, and Indy isn't exactly, like, I don't... Indy is definitely a runner. Like, they, they are, as in, they will run errands and do stuff, which means they won't necessarily always be at the house, and we need a few people who are not always there, but who are willing to be there every so often and play these roles of, like, members of a household. Like, staff members of a household. And we'll have to pay them. Oh, bloody... I'll try to check the telegram later. Malone. Is that Malone? Oh dear. So, I'm going to go to the bathhouse, take a bath, but there is someone that is always there and they always seem to be on their own. I might be wrong, but... Also, we know that they're weird and dodge because they've always hung around with Mama Christine, who seems to have vanished off the face of the earth. Hello. Do you work here? No, I'm a caretaker. I'm taking care of my grandma and grandpa right now. Right, are your grandpa and grandma in the bath? Yeah, getting bathed and getting real clean right now. And they're having a hard time. And they can't get in, in and out of the bath too easily anymore. They're, oh. It's almost their time. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um... It's almost time for the cold, eternal sleep that we all shall face someday. <laughs> a little more soon than others. Uh, yes, I, I suppose so. Uh, Are you looking for a bath? I was. Yeah, I will. I will wait uh, quite happily. Oh sure, yeah. It's a, probably gonna be a few few minutes. Well, if you don't okay. mind waiting. Well, yeah, I, I do. We can. I guess. We can talk. You clearly need yeah. some sunshine in your life. <laughs> yeah, I'm not I'm, sure I can provide sunshine, but well, I can provide I, I've conversation. Found a purpose today. I'm, I'm, I'm being a good boy today. I'm taking care of my gra my grandparents here. Are you not usually well well behaved? Oh no, I, I am. I am. <laughs> that little at the end didn't didn't feel like you were so sure. No, oh, no, no, no. Good boy. My, my name's Good Boy Chaz. Chaz. Good boy Chaz. Is good that, boy Chaz. Is that short for anything, Chaz? Oh no, it's just Chaz. Just Chaz. <laughs> ah, okay. Well, my name's Cecily. It's a pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Cecily. Very nice to meet you. Are you are you, sh are you sure? You you don't you don't seem too too sure. <laughs> Why are you asking if I'm not too sure? Of course because, I'm sure. It's nice okay. to meet you. Of course. What do you think? Oh. Uh, okay. Well, You're no. Most guy. people. I mean, I what? Like no, well, no. Most people, people don't. No, people definitely don't like that. What? I, <laughs> no. <laughs> I, um, no, 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 don't, don't, don't do that. Because no. you'll make me cute. Guy, I can't stop. <laughs> oh, Chaz, are you okay? Oh, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm right. good. I'm fine. I'm <laughs> just, you know, hanging around old people. It's, it's depressing. It really is. You're just waiting for them to die. And every day, you're just waiting for them. Is today the day where I get my inheritance or what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Mm. Yeah, 
Yeah, so I suppose. I feel the same way about my father. My oh. son! I, I think so, I'm not sure. Right there. Hey! Oh, uh, good day, miss. Oh. Sorry, we're, we're just a bit... Uh, How do you uh, feel? Flooded with customers right I now. I feel... No, right. right. I mean, I can come back later. Everything is good with the world. Oh, 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 great, uh, you're scared. Is this your girlfriend? Um, oh. Yeah, you could. Yeah, um, <laughs> I'll leave you two with that. Um, uh, oh. Right. Uh, well, no, we've just we've just met, Miss, but you have a very lovely grandson. Oh, thank you. He's so sweet. He is the best. The best boy. What? Who are you? Oh, uh, Cecily uh, Caldwell. I'm an, an aspiring author. Oh, one of my late, late. Late husband. He was an author. Oh, what sort of things did he write? <laughs> uh. You have to be patient with her. She sometimes just falls asleep while she's oh. standing. <laughs> right, yes. Uh, I had a grandfather that used to do exactly the same. It's a thing that happens when your brain is old that it takes longer to process these sorts of information that you can get, you know? <laughs> ah, my late... late... Oh, are you are you late... Okay, madam? husband. He was an author. Uh, yes, what, what, what did he, he write? He wrote books. <laughs> oh, right. Well, About, um... <laughs> Jesus Christ! I'm naked people! <laughs> I'm so... <clears throat> Sorry? Yes, we used to write books. Yes, books. About naked people. Right, okay. Oh, Jesus. Um, hey, uh, do you have any of those for sale? Don't tell the wife. What? Um, I have a signed original. It says, To my dearest Maud. Oh, good day, right. sir. Good day. There's a bit Mrs. of a queue for the bath right now. Shincracker. Oh, wait, wait. Wait, no, you can't forget bath, sir. They're very important. Oh, I love uh, you so very much. Oh, my God. Things have escalated and there quick. if you ever want to relive those cracking good memories... Oh. Parentheses. Ha ha. Close parentheses. You know, I'm just down the street. All my love. I think she's going to have to go for it behind the hands behind the back. Dixie. Normous. <laughs> oh, well, that's a very lovely um, dedication for a book. <clears throat> yeah, it was written about our beautiful escapades that we got up to on our honeymoon. Oh, oh, where did where 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 where, where did you honeymoon? We honeymooned right here. In Valentine, we figured that the best place on earth was, in fact, Valentine. Valentine so we decided to get married all the crime. It's Valentine and have our against humanity. It definitely made things very awkward when he and I got divorced. And then he watched me marry two other people. But that book will always be very important. Uh, uh. Would you like to read it? Oh, uh, 
well, I, uh, what? Well, may, maybe one day, perhaps I could uh, take your telegram and and maybe I what um, maybe borrow it at some point. I've I've quite the the reading list at the moment though, and quite a good many books in my my my, my, my satchel. Thank you, thank you for letting me interrupt you. Uh, yeah, oh, hello there. Howdy. Oh, you're so handsome. I was just wondering, oh. as this is a place of healing and relaxation. Yes. Oh. Um, there is a, is a friend French? of mine uh, fell off a cliff while on a horse, mm. and they both uh, plummeted. I see. Oh, thank you, ma'am. Yes, yes, it is my face. Yes, it is very rough. It is oh. also tumble. Uh, it but feels she is recovering. like my chin. It's just... Well, that's my chin. Stare. Oh, that's your chin. But, but my friend is... My friend is... Oh, are you hissing at me like an angry opossum? Yeah. No, that is that's I, that's got to be trend. I mean, that's my old shit. <laughs> anyway, like trend, uh, but it? my friend, she is. Uh, do you mind if she sits in here and with her broken leg? I broke my leg one time. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, but that's a great story. That's that's trench. Yeah, he he came story. through there. We had. I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. Sir, so bring her on in. A long time ago. Gosh, I isn't she was... great? She, 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 she's, she's delightful, uh, Chaz. Telling people about her. That's going to be so sad. <laughs> God. Oh, yes, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'm sure it will be. But, uh, uh, I, well, uh, all, all good stories come, come to an end. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's the same. It's the same for quite a few of us, though. Like sometimes just, you just hear you know the kind of person. books you read where they just keep going on and on and on, and you just won't stop. You know, and then you just w wish the end would just come. He's gonna Every kill page, his grandmother. You, you want to skip a few, you know? Oh right, yes. Uh... And pardon me, fine gentlemen. Oh, Oh, Melbourne, thank you very much. You? I appreciate it. Yeah. Sounds like a waste oh, of my late, 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 late wife. Put on sometimes, you know. Late wife. A right in here. Hey, She's very much... my right, late, why don't you sit on that nice late, fine couch late, over there, Matilda? Late wife. Okay. Okay, yeah. all right. She was making a horse of oh, it with his wife. And it went so crazy with Just rage and lust. It was so... both on the oh, yeah, that's Buck wild. The horse died. Uh, yeah, you but I think they said it wife. died yes, but just because she crushed late, it when it died. Late wife. Oh, my God. Oh, you got to be her king now, Lily. Oh, 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 it's Lily. 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 Oh, I don't know what this is. I came in right every time Cecily has come into this damn bathhouse. Well, it's just been Lily pretty much there on her own. So I'm like, I want to grab her. I want to poke this woman. And the, for the one time ever where I'm like, this is going to be great, she'll be on her own. I'll get to have a nice little conversation. Everyone is here. So I'm just going to stand here in the background, hiding behind this door, and I'm going to wait patiently and watch the violent crimes to humanity. Oh, you got shh, problems. Shh, shh, shh. Yeah, well, uh, that's right. Matilda, no, I'm no, gonna run. Yeah. No, this uh, is they so said they'd be happy run. to sponge bath you if you need it. My wife uh, requested late, to never see me again. This late, is not my wife. Oh, I'm so late, sorry. Late, late say husband that again? who ran away from me. No, that's that's my chin, ma'am. Yes. I was yeah, surprised right. he ran away or was able to run away from you on account of you were yeah, able I, to this guy just wants his down on your you. I, I'm, I'm half oh, tempted to kill the old funny. woman My just to put this guy out of his misery. She was uh, making a horse a bit with her thighs and it might probably start. shattered its ribs <sighs> and it went flying off a cliff. With I her wonder on it. if. Anyway, oh, I'll be back to check you a little bit there, Matilda. Into killing his grandparents. Oh, I wonder. Oh, Could I be the devil in his ears? Thanks, Fred. Come back. Thanks Where did very my much, Fred. Go? Oh, oh, I'm gonna afraid afraid of the no, I'll, I'll let him you can go to the bath whenever you want, by the way. I, I don't think I'm gonna go yet. 
Oh no no, it's fine. I'll just uh, I'm quite. Is it free? Oh, just oh, okay, you're right. I think they should oh, change the water you? though yeah, before you go. Mm, I think I'll. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. I think I, I'm, I'm oh, sure to ask for that. Oh, no, 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 this is, this is almost too good of an opportunity to, to miss being a writer at all. He helped me learn the time oh, Well, Grandpa's got a lot of stories. Goodness. And don't right. get him started about Biggie Eaton. Right, was that 45 years ago. The day, oh, there right, go. yes. They hadn't invented the aglet yet, so we had to tie it ourselves every time round it real and tight. Need the water. He had the water. Well, well, the aglet. Yeah. We hadn't invented the aglet yet, so I every don't even time know what you tie your shoes, you have to form an aglet so you could get the strings round and under it other was the proper way of doing it back then yes. right so anyway ma'am what what uh, what bathing requirements did you say you had well uh, as you can see my left leg is entirely in a cast it is yes so, i don't know if we're going to be able to bathe the cast miss oh sorry about oh, that. Yeah. that okay probably best not to bathe the cast so that it can like heal and things yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I suppose, uh, are those stitches on your forehead, are they very fresh? You want to keep them out of the water as well? Hello, yeah, man. that would be ideal. Hello, okay, welcome to that house. All right, Melvin. Uh, well, here's what I'm thinking. Uh, I don't we suppose you, uh, you want to buy any sausages, do you? Strings or ropes, keep it dry. Mm -hmm. Not a taxidermy and, and, uh, deer, you numbskull. All I'm asking is $20. Foot. I called you a numbskull, mate. Oh, well, you know, he might not be... I don't know, is that a bad idea? What do you think? Wait, yeah, absolutely. Well, the, the uh, numbers go a bit or the taxidermy? The keeping her leg up out of water with the ropes. Is that all right? Well, I don't, I don't know. It depends how high the cast goes, mate. I, we might just be hanging a half of her from the busted. ceiling at that Look point. Look at it. That thing is busted as hell. Yeah, I, well, I was thinking maybe a sponge bath. Have you ever done one of them before, here? Yeah? Oh, you know what? That would be good. Yeah, that'd be good. I, you, you can't, you we can't say it. The Melvin, you... From the equation. Yeah, you, know, yeah, you okay. just you can't say yeah that'd be good after I say that. It sounds there you a bit go, weird, yeah, right, my love. All right, well, you know. All Excellent. right. Thanks a lot. See ya. Oh, there he goes. Better oh. days are ahead. Take care, Fred. Yeah, thanks uh, for yeah, coming. No, thanks for coming to the bathhouse. Just Bye. one lily on her own. Oh, get some sponges. Better oh, days are ahead. Oh, it's my husband. Yeah. It's just old. Howdy. What well, the sponges? Uh, how are you? Uh, oh, quite no, fresh. Sorry. Oh, right. how are you? I meant the old man. You said he was oh, a weirdo. I'm well, and he was just old. Uh, have no, you seen any of my stuff fillers? fillers? Oh. oh, no, sorry. I must see them today. Okay. Howdy. Hey. Wow. You look so fancy. Well, thank you for putting on my fancy oh. clothes today. Sure. Is it a, a special occasion? It's just time for me to is, is, clean is up my here? other clothes. And this is the only other outfit mm -hmm. I got. Oh, hello. Hello. I'm um, oh, sorry to make you wait. Uh, yes, wanting a bath? Uh, well, I, I, I was very much a privately on my own one, though, but um, I, I'm happy to wait whilst others are well, probably more in need of it. Uh, need it. Oh, oh, um, the bus should be free now, if you right, like. Perfect. I can go right ahead. Yeah, okay. Smart, oh, like right. Yeah, yeah, yeah sounds good. Um, so you oh, this is busy. Um, no, I was actually, it's a strange thing to see. Really like it was so quiet Ooh, yesterday, yeah, and now, all of a sudden, everybody is here. <laughs> Mm -hmm. wow. I know it's a. Uh, well, I was it's quite, 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 quite surprised. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So what's there you... been? There hasn't been any uh, poos about. Uh, oh, oh I can get the water changed for you. And oh, thank you. Should be, should be ready. Me. Oh, that's good. Uh, no, no, not not your wife's sister. Clean what? Unless you, Family, unless your wife's sister is from Newfoundland. Clean shit. Newfoundland. Oh, really? <laughs> oh, like a boat. No, I just meant, oh, really? Is she from Newfoundland? Now okay. that I mention it. Well, uh, bye bye. Okay, well, you have a great evening. Uh, you too, My partner. Canada. Yep. Aw, Jug. That's right. Shuffles. Okay. Oh, what? Your bath is ready. Oh, right, uh, thank you. Are you sure this lady here doesn't want to go in first? 
Uh, well, I think oh, no. if you don't I'm mind, in no rush. ma'am, yeah, <laughs> considering it might take a bit of time with her, it's probably best you go first. Oh, honestly, I am more than happy to, to wait. Oh, injured no, first. don't worry about it. I'm not going to get any more injured and I'm not going to get any more dirty. Well, I so don't know why about don't that. Well, I wouldn't say that sitting in the bathhouse lobby, right, ma'am? Come on. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Honestly, I insist. And I, if I'm being perfectly honest, people watching here is actually quite fun, so... If you go and take your time, it just gives me a reason to linger longer. Well, all right. If that's all right with you. That's absolutely fine. Okay, well done. Shall we go? Right. Uh, do you need any help getting there? Uh, I think I can, uh, I think I can get there, but maybe just it. be there if I fall or whatever. Yeah, yeah, I'm a Where professional carrier. Just down the, down the corridor here, ma'am. Okay. We're gonna get Lily. This is my goal. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, Lily. Good news update. Oh fuck! She got to wash them. Damn it! Damn it! Absolutely god damn it! I don't even need a bath. I'm clean. Who are those people? I see the crate. Complimentary breakfast. Oh, that's dubs. I'll talk to this guy then. Escorted her down there. She didn't fall. I was worried that leg was gonna snap and give out. Yeah, it don't look that secure, does it? It doesn't. It looked like it had a little bit of a wobble to it. Uh, do you know what? I realized. Been a break in it or something. What? Sorry, I realize I come in here quite often, and I've never thought to ask your names. I've definitely paid both of you before for the baths. Hmm. So, I yeah, should introduce name? myself. Oh, yeah. Oh, I will introduce myself first, and then you can choose if you want to introduce yourselves to me. My name's Cecily Cadwell. I'm a spy. Is that author. right, Cecily Cadwell? Caldwell, yes. Cecily Cadwell. Mm -hmm. Cow, yeah, Cadwell. Cadwell. Like a well full of cow. Oh, oh, oh! Wait, no! Wouldn't that just be a, a well full of milk? Well, I mean, technically, it's actually well. cold well. You like, could just put the bucket in the time, but... Cold well. Or cold, fresh well. Or, yeah, that'd be nice. Why don't we have a well in Valentine? Well, oh. we got the water bucket. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, you've seen that last well, year, and I should, uh, should have thought before I said that, shouldn't I? Yeah, maybe, yes. Oh, there is a well in Valentine somewhere, isn't there? Am I making things up? Maybe. Oh well, I mean, when you find it, Miss Can, Miss Coldwell, you let us know. Right, yes. The well detective, Coldwell. The key, oh, you could work on them Coldwell cases. Oh right, <laughs> perhaps. No, I I mostly just write fictional stories, which is probably why so she's a well I've imagined detective. one. Oh, you're right, a anyway, detective. I'm a, I'm a Dale Dugmore. Uh, Pleasure to meet yeah. you, Mr. Dugmore. And my name is Ernie Lancaster. Well, what? Mr. Lancaster, the pleasure's all mine. Wait, what? Why do you wait, seem wait. so surprised at this gentleman's name? Uh, no, uh, first time I've met him. First time I've met him, actually. Oh, do you not both work here together? Yeah, there's different shifts. There's, come on. Yeah. Huh, come on. Enough. Come on, you know? Yeah, Jesus Christ, miss. You should know that. Uh, what Being about a the... detective and all. Um, I'm not a detective, no. I'm a writer. I write fiction. Yeah, There's writing no detective, detective work, stories because but... you're a detective of wills. What? Cold I ones, I suppose, actually, I am quite fond of the Sherlock Holmes novels. They're fairly new. The fuck are you? What is a Sherlock this? Holmes? Is... Oh. Oh. That was a bit. I'm just kidding. Oh, well. Oh, right. Yeah, I... yeah. No, I was well, just joking. I, yeah, he didn't mean it. He didn't mean it. <laughs> Good, because I'll snap his finger off now. Well, um... Cecily's in a thought process. So what led you to the detective life, ma'am? Wait, nothing has led me to the detective life, sir. Oh, that's, uh, that's exactly what a detective would say right there. That's how it happens. If yeah. I was a detective, you would never know it. <laughs> well, that's, that's why you keep it. denying it. Yeah. Yeah. So the uh, less I think you're a detective, the more I should. Good heavens, you I think that me. person just stole my horse. Oh, shit, really? No, it's all good. I didn't need it anyway. Carry on. <laughs> 
Sorry? You just yeah, lost, you know, big deal. Yeah, yeah, well, I mean, it's named after my wife, but honestly, I could probably do with getting rid of it because if my wife finds out I named a horse after her and it's a very large, chubby horse, she might not be too happy. <laughs> um, don't tell the so, wife, all right? Hey. A horse? Uh, well, hey, I, I, hey, I, I, I don't hey, know hey, your hey, wife. Oh, Are you working for my wife? Good heavens, you've caught me, yes. I'm working for your wife. She's very Jesus disappointed Christ, in you, I don't want to have to kill people. Ooh. Oh, it's a joke. I hope so. <laughs> I, I couldn't kill a detective. It's like killing a deputy, isn't it? Oh, absolutely, oh, yeah. yes. In fact, it's like killing a marshal. It's even worse. Oh, my God. Mm. Uh, well, yes. uh, yeah. Uh, do you want to take a seat so you don't accidentally trip on the carpet and die? Oh, no, don't worry. I'm very good with you my... Sure that, yes, like, you sure? You would fine. not believe the amount of people that have tripped on that carpet. Mm. I do it almost every day. It's ridiculous. Right, Isn't well, that right, Melvin? You well, should look where your carpet, feet are going. Board that should be really getting nailed down more, so... I think that's what well, I mean, isn't that your job? Well, you know, cover it up, and that's good enough, I see. Yeah, most of the time. That's what I do with my wife. Just cover things up so she don't know about them. This is a right. lady you're talking in front of here, Dale. Yeah, it's not my wife. Well, no, just the detective hired by her. Oh, my God. Ooh, but gotcha. I was actually... I was just wondering, mm. um, the young miss went back there. So that's Lily, isn't it? The young lady that had a... Yeah, Miss Linwood, you've got, with, uh... it sounds like you've got something in your throat there, Miss. Mm -hmm. Is it? Do I still sound like I have something in my no, throat? No, you don't. You're good. No, I just meant uh, she's just the, the young... Well, I can ask her. Yeah, yeah you can, is. yeah. Oh, there we go. All right, Lily. There you go. You just... Oh, oh. Ooh, hope you... Look hope how you, clean hope actually, you both went well, ma'am. I'm, oh, I'm actually that was gonna... wonderful. Thank you very much. Pay I'm going to go get some water from the barrel. Do you mind if I just sit here and wait for my friend for a bit? Yeah, you can't do it. I was actually, um, well, so I, I come in here quite a lot to take a bath, and you're usually here on your own, um, uh, Miss Lily. <laughs> so I, I was wondering what it is you do when, say, the next shift takes over. The, the next shift? Hmm, well, apparently this gentleman here works a different shift. Oh, oh yes, uh, Uncle Melvin. Yeah, he he is like the later shift. Mm -hmm. All right, and does um does the bathhouse pay you well? Well, um, the way it works is that uh, we just um and what the what the customers pay, we don't take away just such. Oh right. I mean, it, is this all you've ever done, or? Um, mostly yes. Uh, I do a little a, a bit of uh, baking at the side as well. Oh, you bake? Mm -hmm. That's, I mean, I, well, do, do you bake to order or? Oh, yes, I, I can take orders. I, I do, can do my boxes. I, I, yeah. Jesus, this oh, coffee, I'm fucking oh. telling you. Oh, my God. What, perhaps I could take your telegram down and maybe you're, you're contact you about putting in an order. There you go, there you go. Oh sure, that's Let me really just get the, the book out. Oh, sorry, sorry, Melvin. Okay. Oh, what are you flapping for, Lily? Uh, well, she's she's going to uh, possibly make, make an order for some big goods. Sorry, what's your telegram? Oh uh, shit! Oh Jesus Christ! Oh Valentine. Oh, I missed that. See you back. Oh, I didn't catch any of that. I'm afraid. For lobster, yeah. they'd oh, be my. all over oh, the beach. Oh my God! They, they, who the fuck is that? Jesus. Sorry, is it okay if I just? Yeah, I'm looking around. Let's go around the back. Where did you? So I've been desperately trying to come and talk to you for a very long time. It seems every time I want to talk to you, it's always very busy. So. I'm so sorry. No, it's not your fault. I just feel like I come in here so often. I should have spoken to you more in depth by now. Right, so it's Lily and your telegram is... Uh, pink Valentine zero oh, eight zero. Valentine 080. Yep, baby, 080. Perfect, right. Uh, my name's Cecily, if I haven't already told you it before in the past. I'll, oh, yes, I... I'll send you a telegram of mine in it. Just to oh, save streaming telegrams around the bathhouse, and I will, I will leave you to get back to work. Is it okay for me to hop oh. into that bath before I go? 
Oh, absolutely. You go right ahead. Oh, thank perfect. you so much. Thank you. No, thank you. Right, we've got Lily's telegram. That's enough. I'm going to offer her a job at the manor, maybe baking there. Because I'm not having that conversation in front of that much absolute degeneracy. But yeah, Lily is precious. We love her. She's So something I feel like is she's always... She's nearly always stood in the bathhouse on her own. And there's the odd moments where they're like this. And I kind of want to just give her another avenue of interacting with people in a different area. So she's not on her own. Like, I know some people it's their jam. But no when you're a bit like, but is it really your jam to be stood in one place for like six hours? So I'm going to open the door. Being and sneaky, and right? You can't blame me. I'm not the sneaky one. Oh my god, where the fuck did she come from? Right. Oh, she was taking a bath. Oh my god. Uh, well, thank well, you for the bath. The it was on a... the carpet. I'm carefully on the carpet. It was a pleasure to meet you. Uh, all of you. And I hope your leg uh, gets better soon, miss. Yeah, you be safe. Well, thank you Make very sure much. You I appreciate throat. it. Oh, thank you oh so much. yes. No, I was sorry. Yes. Uh, goodbye. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, the shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh right. Yes. Oh, sorry about that. I suppose you were right. Oh, I got it. I got it. Is my th uh, do I sound terrible in game? Is my mic fucking up? I think it's because I I move. Away. Oh, oh. Have I just popped my ear? No, it did. Oh God. Is she? Is this sleepwalking? Is that what she's doing? Am I sleepwalking? Uh, oh god, it's the old lady. Yeah, I don't know. It might be in game. Like, it might have been worth listening in on uh, sending one even to listen in on iWatch stream and just be like, what do I sound like? Because thing is, I move my head away from my mic so often because the way it's set up, my mic arm isn't long enough for me to sit central to my screen. So I'm kind of squiffing and moving and leaning. Really, I need to invest in a new mic. Like, I've got a good one, and it's fairly new, but just, it's not up to scratch, guys. It's not up to scratch. Matt, okay, I'll take the, the caboose. Meet me there. Buttman. Like, why does everything have to be sexual? I never said it's sexual. People can like butts in a non-sexual way. But man, Jesus, you don't want to make it sexual, silly. Yeah. What is that conversation that is happening? And why is it happening? <laughs> Back to the tip line up, you can catch them. I think they're over there. Yeah, okay. Right. Wait for Malone to get out there. Oh, thank you. Move on. You know who helped me with this outfit? Don't all right, all aboard on the knee, final call. Mm hmm. And maybe he's got a, a very similar outfit to this. Look at his uh, head. And then I want to. Oh, shit. Oh, she. Actually, I don't know. I think things are popping. One sec. Let's see if I can fix some things. Um. Well, I think it's my mic. My headset is popping in my ear. Why is that doing that? That's why. Fixed. Oh shit, Tristan! I didn't send him anything either. Bollocks. I'm terrible at remember. I say to people, I'm like, I'll send you a telegram, and then I forget, and I'm like, damn, that was a useful person, and then I, yeah. Lily. Sad. Lily. It was wonderful. Talk to you some more. Where's Malone? It's a good question. He said if he you was find telegrams. yourself at a loss of things to do, wait, there he is. Please reach out. 
perhaps you could come and visit the manor. The manor sometime. Happy to have someone come and accompany you. Cecily. Pleasure. Uh, 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 uh. It's fine, I'm truly terrible. Right, we'll do that and then we'll head to Rhodes and I'll send shipment a thingy. When we get to Rhodes. Oh! Where's my horse? You butthole. Look the books. Come on, fella. Let's see if we can make our way to the manor without uh, getting lost. What do we want? 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 Best way to go where I'm trying to go. So one takes you to the bridge. So it was that way I wanted. Okay. I've gone the wrong way again, haven't I? That's me thinking I was taking the right path. What's this?
Okay, on lunch. What are you having for lunch? What are we doing, sister? We are heading back to the manor. We're going to have a nice easy Sunday where we're going to try and build up our civilian front. And I love that. I'm having homemade chicken soup. You love that we're having homemade chicken soup or that we're trying to have a nice easy day building up the civilian front? Well, we need to get a household together. Uh, that's I, That seems to be the vibe we're going with for like the front. And with our guys doing the crime that they're going to be doing a lot more, we need to be able to protect them. And the best way to do that is to hide them behind civilian activity. So... We're going to get some civilian stuff working. We will hire staff for the manor. And I'm picking out the ones that I love. Like, Lily, we only ever see her standing in that bathhouse. Like, she is so fucking, like, she is like a pillar. So we want that kind of, of commitment to things. Lily is a sweet bean as well, isn't she? No one's going to hurt us if we have Lily. <laughs> Hiding behind Lily. She would make a beautiful host, wouldn't she? Now, it's a pleasure getting to... Spend and hear about your plans. This is my telegram. Don't forget it this time. The few the indie ones, good. I still need to get Chucky's telegram. Fuck me. I've got it somewhere and I keep misplacing it. Oh, Hefe. If you think you're not one of those civilians, you are sorely mistaken. I'm stealing you from Guama. They don't deserve Jeff. They don't deserve our Hefe.
Nah, to be fair, Dwalin needs to stop working first. Damn. How dare he have a real life <laughs> and work and go outside and touch grass? How very dare he! Oh, that's heartbreaking. Oh, I need to... Let's do this. Because we are the home. Horses? Whose horses have we got? Three horses? Who's here? I know one of those is... Ah, who is here? One of these horses belongs to... to Tomato? Who's is the... Is that a fox trotter? Hey, Hello. I couldn't find you in Valentine. I was... I was... I was in the bathhouse being oh. absolutely harassed by Valen crimes to, to, to humanity. Oh! For a gay there. That's not what happened. They had a fight. <laughs> Who's had a fight, sorry? The lady in Dex. She just came over to tell you that he was attacked by a gator, but that's not what happened. No, no. Oh, right. Do you know I'm not, I'm not getting involved. Yeah, I wouldn't. I just want you to know that he's not dying. That's it. Is that... Uh, Declan? Is this that is... Declan? I was this about to say, is that Declan? Uh, CC? Hey, CC. It's good to see you again. It's been a while. It's good to see you too, yes. Yeah, since we last met, I've, uh, I've gotten married to this fine woman here. <laughs> Mm, yeah. I heard the story about the three wives. Oh, oh, yes. Yeah, so, no, well, I'm a wife of the three wives. Yeah, yeah see, I'm not. Extended I'm not Jabibi's wife. <laughs> <laughs> it's an extension. It's... I did say Valen oh, Christ humanity. Sake. Yeah. Please don't start some kind of family wreath, you know, where it just <laughs> fucking goes around in a circle. <laughs> oh, right. Is that? Is that Costas? Mm -hmm. it, it is. is Costas. Yes. Mm -hmm. I hope it's okay that Declan's here. I just figured, you know, if he's friends with no, me, no, it's be absolutely fun. disgusting. I don't want him here. It is fine. We've spent some time together. I'm rather fond of Declan. Good, good. <laughs> I think the last time I saw you was up in Coulter. Uh, we were on an adventure. Yeah, trying to Dex. find a way between Wapiti and the frontier. <laughs> I took a few tumbles that day. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah, well, everybody does when they go up there. It's just the thing that happens. Yeah, yeah, okay, oh, see, see. Did you Did you get those alligator teeth? Do you still have all your teeth? No, I did not. I'm all right. Okay, good. I was a little no, worried about said, that. Fucking, you know, she teeth. hit me first, so I punched her, and she smacked my head against the fucking wall. She got right. problems. I told her to Why fuck is... off back to this swamp. You did what? <sighs> Maybe I was a little bit angry. Hipster. She smacked my head against the wall. She smacked my head against the wall. I'm not gonna lie, she deserved it. If yeah. not, and I'd say that, but she did. She was going to be all right. him, calling him a pussy and saying that she was trying to teach him how to be a man. So and I when he stopped punched... him back, she uh, smashed yeah. her head against the pillar. I told right. her I was going to hit her back, and then when um, I start fucking hitting her... I'm about to do something that I really hate that I'm about to do, but... Dexter, a word please. <sighs> <laughs> You following me? I'm just gonna drown him. <laughs> Imagine. 
You're all right, CC. Everything all right? Are you okay? I'm fine, yeah. Look, she, uh... She... I think she asked for it, you know, and then she just smacked my head against the pillar. What's that all about? It? Right, I don't know, but Dex, you do realise that because of her closeness to you, she already knows far too much about what we do, and if you piss her off, she might be a very big issue. I'd rather keep her close than have to kill her. I'd kill her, don't worry about it. No, Dex, you wouldn't. I would. No, because I was going to ask you to do that to someone that's special to you. <sighs> Fine, yeah, I wouldn't. She's a good friend, but she didn't what she'd do that for. I don't know, what were you saying to her to prompt it? No, she... You know what Delaney's like, right? She was just fucking around, and she said that she hid something, and she was saying, don't take a shit in my crate, Dex. And I said, look, I ain't going to take a shit in your crate. Why would I go all the way to find where you put your crate to open it and take a shit in it? This is ridiculous, you know? I said, just, besides, you probably ain't got nothing in there. I could, anyway, it just went on, and then she punched me, and then said, look, I said, I ain't hitting you back. And she punched me again, so I said, I ain't hitting you back. So then I punched her about four or five times in the face. And then she grabbed my head and slammed it up against the pillar. Right. She gets like that. Dexter, you need to keep her happy and calm, I'm afraid. Well, I just told her to fuck off back to the swamp. Right, well, no one wants to hear that. For all we know now, she's going to fuck off back to the law or to something no, worse she, than no, the law. No, she, she ain't like that, trust me. She'll be... We, we, we'll, she'll no, be fine. when people are hurt, they act irrationally. Fuck. Well, you just acted irrationally. You were hurt and you told you're her to right. fuck off no, back to the swamp. You are right, yeah, you, you are right. I know yeah, she probably yeah, wasn't the I best thing to face, do, but she wouldn't do anything like that. As far as loyalty goes, she, I trust her. She, she wouldn't. Dex, people are only loyal as long as people are loyal to them. You're not really giving her much to, to trust you on. I don't you've really know. You've abandoned her, you've insulted her. I mean. She doesn't you know think you I... care. No, and we she's, just. She's, she's utterly unhinged, bug nuts, crazy. There you go. There it is. You just said it, didn't you? Now you know. Yes, I did. And I and hate it... the fact that you've, you've, I've said, I hate the fact that those words have just left my mouth. I, I know. No, look, I can make you feel a little bit better, though. She, uh, we, we just had a lovely chat. Like, this is why, you know, we had a nice conversation. I met her in Rhodes. I rode down with her and we stood on the side of the waters and we had a nice chat. Well, that's all well and good, Dex, but that nice chat ended in you saying, fuck off back to the swamps. <gasps> Train, is it a high value? Look where your mind's going, straight to the gold after me getting my head slammed against the fucking pillar. Right, shush. Mm, I think yes, boss. Is that high value? I can't tell. Bloody hell. No, that's just a passenger. But... Mm, that's a shame. Is that just a... Yeah, okay. <sighs> Best place to be situated. Yeah, it's very good. Make I'll go good. find her. No, uh... Are you sure? I don't really want to send you away, but... Oh, I won't be gone long. Oh, she could be anywhere. And besides, if I don't come back, then you know head, that she's chopped me up into little pieces and thrown me to the alligators, and that'll be your fault, won't it? <laughs> uh, um, how is your head, by the way? Did, did one of those check you over? Yeah, yeah, the captain did. It's all right. What did the captain do? He applied some, I don't know what you call it, he put some on, Delaney asked what he was doing and he said it was something he learned from the army, so... It stung a little bit. It's just a graze, just a bruise, you know, she didn't knock me out, but I just couldn't fucking get back up, I was a little bit... Uh, uh, right, okay. Mm -hmm. No, stay still. Uh -huh. It's all right, don't worry about it. You can lower my head. I want you to just follow my finger. With your oh. eyes, please. Okay, I'm following it, I'm following it. Mm. 
Aha, ja, ich sehe, ich sehe. I'm all right. Honestly. She just... She just, uh... She did my head, you know, that's all. Right, no, yes. I don't, you know, you know head injuries are actually quite severe. They can result in things like a brain bleed. Yeah, no, that's why I told her to fuck off back to the swamp. No, I mean, that's not why you told her to fuck off back to the swamp. No, it ain't. Dex, no, I was really angry. You have such a difficult, strained friendship with her. And from where I'm standing, it looks like you're the one that's being cruel. Wait, how, how do you come to that conclusion, See, she, she just nearly knocked me out. Right, yes, but you're well aware that she's troubled. She, you know I read that telegram, so you know that I know her, her secret. How would you feel if someone well, knew your secrets? And pushed you away. Yeah, but I wasn't pushing her away. I was actually trying to help her. I was telling yes. her. That... Yes, I the was... words fuck off back to the swamp isn't pushing someone away. Oh, see, see, that was after, right? That was. That was after we had the, the chat. You know, I was. You know how kind I was being to her. I told her today that there's a room that she could stay in if she wanted to. And I said Did that. Did you tell you know, her it was under the stairs? No, I told her. I said, especially not that one as well. I said, look, I said, you can come shirts. by here whenever yeah, you want. Indian and I even told her, you know, so that, Mertel, you know, she, she's welcome. I, I said a lot of things. Do you know what? I, I did. I made sure that she was, uh, she felt good. And we had a great chat. And then she was joking. And then next thing you know, she's punching me in the fucking face. Right. I suggest you take someone and go find her just to make sure she's okay. And not doing anything out of spite she wouldn't do that but yeah of course i will i will okay. all right are you all right though you know just i'm um, you yeah. don't think it's me it's, it ain't me i ain't done nothing wrong you don't think i'm a, I'm, I'm an idiot or something do you because i to be honest Dex. i thought i was doing something real nice Dex. there for her take a breath <sighs> yeah yeah mm -hmm. and get out of your head you're fine but telling someone to fuck back to the swamp is not a kind thing to say. I know that, yeah. Yeah, I, I certainly know that, but... Maybe I was just angry. Oh, fuck it. I'll go find her, alright? I'll try. Okay. Right, well, no, it's... Okay, take someone with you, though, so you don't get eaten by an alligator. You got things to do here? I mean, you can't... Uh, you stay here, actually. You're probably going to be needed here, aren't you? Mm-hmm. I'll take the captain. Oh, Dex, yeah, very quickly. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I ain't interrupting nothing, am I? No, you're good. No, no, no. It's all right, Captain, uh, you, you, uh, you mind taking a ride with me? we got to go find Delaney. Jesus wept. Why are people so ridiculous? <laughs> She's in her head. Man. I think, uh, I think she's having a little think. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> so how have you been ever since? I've been okay, how about you? I've been, I've been alright, been alright. Definitely, uh, you know. I mean, I've got a couple extra cars since you last saw me, but it is what it right. is. Right, and how did you get them? I mean, I got stabbed once and... Uh, Sorry, wait, what? Who stabbed you and why? Uh, I got stabbed in the back by Angus. Like, Who's Angus? A week ago. An angry little... Scottish kid. Right, why was an angry little Scottish kid stabbing you in the back? Uh, because And not he's... the front, like a real a real mm. person. No, as, as soon as I turned around, he stabbed me. It was, it was fun. I was in front of a fucking medical office, which was lucky. Um, he, He's a hothead, and he... For Hi some reason, up. is very protective over Sheila yes, in a very bad way. Yes, that would be and I was having a conversation with him where everything that he was doing was just causing more problems. And, uh, well, I guess he got angry and uh, had the result to stabbing me. Huh. Aye. Well, other than being stabbed in the back, what have you been up to? Ah, uh, not entirely too much. Um, well, I, I see that. It's, it's kind of trying to liven up with PD again. 
because it was quiet for a while. Oh, you stood up in Wapiti? Hmm. Yeah, I'm either there or in Blackwater. It's uh -huh. basically the two places I tend to stay. Uh, it's been a while since I've been up in Coulter for, you know, a decent amount of time. But... Oh, right. Well, I suppose me too, actually. The last time I visited Coulter, you were there. That's when I met you. Mm-hmm. Right, yeah. Yeah, the, the writing, right? Right? You were totally there writing, mm -hmm. not hiding out or anything, you know? No, I was actually there writing. Why? Well, it was a bit of both, if I recall correctly, you were saying. Oh, well, yes, I suppose I hide from my problems quite often. I mean, hey, it's, it's like, one of those things. Forgive me, but what mm -hmm. is it you do? You you hunt, don't you? Yes? Am I just, <laughs> am, am I grasping at straws because I can spot a bow on your back? Maybe? Um, well, I, I do some hunting. No, I actually, I make bows. I guess to a degree, but uh, no, it's 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 not particularly specifically for hunting. I just prefer a bow over a lot of guns. Oh right, fair enough. Um, yeah, that's one of those things. If I ever have to, okay, it's it's gonna sound weird, but if I ever have to make a really long shot, I'm more accurate with this thing than I have a. Nah, don't, don't. Why are you trying to hide your hmm? guns? Well, you just said that you didn't. You, you, uh, what? I I prefer using. A bow over along a lot of the. Do you know what? Me too, yeah. especially in hunting, because the bow mm. only scares the animals in the immediate area rather than all of the animals. Everything the whole all field. around. Oh, yeah, it's, it's the fucking worst when you're trying to hunt in either like Coulter or Big Valley and somebody fucking lets off a bolt action shot and just everything goes running. It's like, oh my god. No. Oh, I've seen that. Myrtle! We, we tried bows the other night. She was like really good. Hmm. And that's another one. Another reason I prefer the bow over a lot of the long arms is uh, when it comes to long range shots, I seem to be more accurate with this thing than I am with a gun. I know, I'm exactly the same. I've killed yeah. many a pack of wolves with a with a bow and arrow. Oh, fucking tell me about it, I... Yeah. Things they just... Mm -hmm. Sorry. No, no, you. you. <laughs> oh, I was about to say, they seem to like, you know, drop down quicker too with a bow compared to like even a bolt action. So, these things pack a punch. Uh, that, yes, yes, they do. Yeah, that's basically all I wanted to say. I don't know. Uh, oh, you know what well, you're no, I just going to say. Do you think we'll be seeing you around here more often, or mm, perhaps do. I can that's steal you away from Blackwater? I doubt I can get you away mm -hmm. from the tribes, but. Uh, yeah, getting me away from the tribes is going to be harder. With the tribes, I mean, it's no fucking secret that the tribes are a mess right now. Oh, what's happening with them? I mean, Topora is at war with the fucking bastards. Oh, right. You know, that's still going, yes. I feel like it's old news at this point, but yes, that water's still fucking going. That's, um... I still don't understand I'm, how that started. I'm part of the war. Um... Well, I, do, how, do you know any of the bastards? I'm assuming you might. Uh, I know of them, yes. Yeah, so have you ever met CD? I met him once, I offered him a hug. I was very quickly threatened to have my arms pulled off, so... There you go. Yeah, I was about to say, have you ever had, had a conversation with CD? Because he's, uh, yeah, yeah, like that. Well, it wasn't and him so... that threatened. <laughs> uh, well, it was one of those things where I think they were running Moonshine, and it was really close to Topora, and the chief of Topora didn't take too kindly to that, because that just... The tribes aren't exactly... They're not unlawful, but they're not lawful, put it that way, right? Um... And a lot of criminal activity around the tribes just gives the sheriff's department a free fucking ticket to uh, search through the villages, which is what they want to avoid. So Chief of Topoana didn't take too kindly about them fucking running shine through the villages. So there was a bit of a an argument about that. Charles Devine being Charles Devine, you know, he's the whole like, oh, I'm a free fucking man. Nobody's going to tell me what to do, blah, 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 blah. I'm going to do whatever the fuck I want because it's just... Charles Devine. Uh, so there was a bit of an argument on that, uh, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Oh. Uh, one shot is alright. That's usually the cougar. No. Um, they, the bastards kind of escalated that by... Do you know Saffron? I don't believe I do, no. Um, well, Saffron's a friend to a lot of the people in the tribes, and um, the bastards decided to... Uh, Rob and um, hurt her quite badly on tribe lands, and that kind of sparked everything. And that was a month and a half ago, and that shit's still going. 
I'm not a part of it, but yeah, it has caused some fucking turmoil up there. Huh. That's a shame. Wait, her, who hurt who? Um, do I, did you know about the fact that Topora's at war with the Bastards? I feel like I may, may have told you. The Bastards? Yeah, it's happened some kind hmm. of time ago. Bastards being huh. the Thieves Landing crew. Charles the Vine, Jabas. Oh, no, I know, oh, I know who they are. Um, hmm. uh, she ain't around here, so uh, we're going to take the mm. horses, all right? Mm. Oh, right, yes. No, I'll be back. Uh, you still going to be around here? Mm-hmm. All right, I'll be back in a bit. I think there is someone running around inside. Oh, for fun. I don't know if... Yeah. Maybe. Delaney, you in here? So I heard some fucking Delaney. doors and shit like that, so... Oh, it could Might be just been... Duck waking up or Indy or... Uh, you know, just the wind blowing doors closed, Whoever I guess. else might be staying here. Oh, Bertie. Oh, uh, Bernie. I need to get that right. Bernie. Delaney, you in here? That was a very graceful dismount on the side of the fountain. Kid. You know what? For a gruff man, he's just quite graceful, this one. Mm -hmm. oh. Dainty. Like, in a I good do. way. I do. Was that still your Morgan? Yeah, it is. Okay. I wasn't awake yesterday, so I haven't had the chance to make any more money. But we're working on it work too. On. We're looking for horses. Mm -hmm. I do appreciate that. Hmm. I mean, of oh. course, it's not a free horse, but. Oh, I understand that. So, I know people are trying to dissuade you, but if you ever want to try a Mustang, you're more than welcome to try mine as well. Thank you very much. be looking at a Mustang. How does that sound? Mm. I might have to. Uh... Take a look at it. Mm -hmm. I mean, the most expensive one when it comes to Mustangs is 500 bucks, so it's not that bad at all. Isn't that the black and white one as well? Uh, no one a, in there. Yeah, the black and white one is 500. There's the white with a little bit of tan is 500, and then the tan with a little bit of white is Maybe you could ask Mr. Costas to send a telegram for you to her. I mean, I don't have a telegram, but unless you want uh, to give me it. You can write for me if you don't mind. Yeah, I'll do it. I know you check my telegrams anyway. All right, well, uh, we'll take a quick trip to Rhodes, and then uh, send a telegram, then have a look around the swamp. Mm. All right. Okay, well, stay safe. Yeah, you too. Uh, we'll be back soon. Oh, I don't plan it to be too long. Uh, hopefully she... Uh... Yeah, she'll be all right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Man, I'm just thinking, oh, like, sorry, I'm kind Can of half daydreaming yeah. about ideas. Mm. No, be safe. About the manner yeah, we'll how do, we're going to we'll do, do this. Because it's like a little shit state. Like, why would we, like... One of the things I really want is someone that's just walking around pretending like they're the workmen doing renovations. Like, Something that's what I want. adorable about two fucking grown men on a tiny little Morgan. <laughs> but that's about the same as it's really adorable watching two very tiny women on a rather large, podgy... Shire. Uh, yeah, insert oh, yeah, very yeah. podgy horsey here. <laughs> yeah. um, shit. Where was I? Was I still? I, I don't know. Wait. Oh, man, I, I love, did you want I, an update, Myrtle? On all that? I, I, I love the idea know. of sure. um, I mean, this I place having someone investors. just walking around, constantly so, pretending mm. to be like working on it. I mean, but they have a hammer a going to like, still. defend That's themselves. It comes down to you. And. And so when they're like, why do you have this hammer? They'll be like, I'm doing renovations, sir. Or like, properly. Why exactly is it a war? Um, male ego, I feel like, is the best way to put that. Oh, right. Well, since I've just sent all my firearms off, I'm just going to do a little walk of the area. I'll be right back. Male ego on both sides. Oh, I see. Yeah. This is something Doug does. He walks around and just checks everything out. But I don't... I'm... I, I want to give Myrtle space to do what she's good at, which is acquire information on people and things and situations and events. I don't need to be stood there also listening because she will gather what is needed. Whether it's outdated or not, it's really good to know the history of the conflicts and the crossing for what we're trying to do here. Not really doing a very good walk around, am I? With my cattleman. Jesus Christ, I should have got my scofield off the horse. Hmm. 
Dex needs to be nicer to poor little Swamp Witch Delaney. I like her. She's categorically insane, and she's clearly got something on Dex, which is more than what he's told us. Very clearly. But, like... Oh, wait. Unless, of course, he has told us, and he thinks that that's really terrible. And Cecily's out here being like, nah, you're fine, my guy. I've, I've seen and heard worse. <gasps> that would be awful. That would be awful. How tragic for Cecily. This guy literally turns around and goes, I killed my family. I killed my dad in revenge and I have like this whole desire to kill people. And Cecily is like, oh, okay, Piump. If that was your secret, why are you so worried? Because she's literally seen the worst in things. Oh, is that where Cecily is now? Poor Dex. Poor tragic little Dex. But no, I think there's more there. And I think Delaney has a way of pulling his, his little levers and pushing his buttons. Cecily, I once, I once watched a man get fired out of a cannon. Like, what? We used to throw dynamite at people for fun in Guama. <laughs> so you murdered your dad. Oh. Poor Dex. Uh, I'm absolutely obsessed with the character of Dex, by the way. Like, I, I am. Which means Cecily naturally has a soft spot because I clearly radiate towards the characters. Like, my characters will radiate towards the characters that I, as a player, have a soft spot for. Because I like listening to them and I like talking to them. And, like, I love how Dex just feels like one of those Victorian Gothic-themed video games whenever you talk to him. Like, even his voice... The way he speaks kind of reminds me of something like almost as if you were playing like um uh what's the games that i cannot remember the name of now uh anything set in victoria london let's be honest Puppy Love is one of the books that I really need to finish and just sack off and give it to someone. It's kind of the, like, when it comes to father figures, I guess he's kind of like a father figure to me. Wait, who's uh, your daddy? <laughs> my, uh, yeah, Papa, Papa Ishkide, yeah, Ishkide is him. Oh, one of the natives. Mm, yeah, the one in all white with the deer antlers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, when he found out about um, the fact that Sheila and I were dating, he, uh, he had a conversation with Sheila, and that's how he found out. And after that conversation, he, uh, he turned around to me and he went, Declan, why did you not consult me in this? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> so hang thought. on. Go, go back. You're dating Sheila, the woman that the crazy Scotsman stabbed you over. Mm -hmm. well... Yeah, that's part of why I got yeah. Okay, yeah. but he stabbed you because you're with Sheila or because you did no, something? I'm no. trying to find out where because, we are in uh, this. But because he, for whatever fucking reason, even though it's not a thing, um, thought she's he's obsessed with her to a, a degree, in a fucking bad way. Is and this that one he, that I uh, was real abusive? No, no, that's um, that's Varric. What is this? Absolutely, um, Varric drama. Mm -hmm. Apparently, uh, Varric has uh, been spotted with Wendy. Oh, Grace Gang back. Anyone, yeah. anyone knew well, that Grace Gang is no more, so. Huh. Small world. Okay, continue. Yeah. It's like, yeah, it are we talking about Varric spends time with the, the Dr. Astrid? Yes. Oh, I, oh, I don't I don't know. Yes, Varric and Astrid are friends. And he's spending time with this Wendy woman. Was spotted Apparently, that with I, Wendy, I don't yes. know about that. But, uh, uh. Hmm. Yeah, Andy sent me a Aaron telegram. Told uh, me that uh, last night. Hmm. Right. Yes. Yeah, sorry. You know, and Andy sent me a telegram asking if I knew Wendy, but I, I don't. I haven't heard the name until today. From me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
that's uh, but um uh, shit yeah um because of the previous ties with Varric that Sheila had um Angus has this delusion that because Varric likes to get himself into trouble, that's gonna blow back on Sheila. Even though that's fucking old news. Um, and starts. Oh, he so sees trouble drama. where there is none. And for that reason, thinks that I should take action, even though there is really no trouble to be had. I said it was a stupid idea and it would just cause more fucking issues. Oh, Vinny. And, uh, yeah, that, that was basically the end of that fucking argument. Then I turned around and tried to walk away, and he fucking stabbed me. Hmm. I have chocolate in my mouth, so I can't really talk mm. to him. You can tell. You can tell when I've got something in my mouth. Interesting. The more you know. Yeah. <laughs> um. I, he's, yeah, honestly, if Angus keeps going like Angus is going now, he's gonna be on a fucking tombstone somewhere in the next month, at least. Do you know somebody named Hap? Like H A P? Uh, no, I don't think so. What about you, Susie? Mm -mm, not me. Mm. It's also another person spotted with uh, this Wendy lady. Kind of a fucking name is Hap. I don't know. I mean, at least Cap makes sense because Captain, you know. But Hap, I don't know. What's your name, Happy? Yeah, I was like, it's, I feel like I'm trying to figure out what the fuck it's short for. Ooh, happenstance? Hmm. Maybe. Hmm. Maybe it's his initials. Maybe his name's like Herbert. Henry Albert. Albertius. Pennywise. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if all of those were your names, you would go by Hap. Let's be real. <laughs> fucking change your name real fucking fast. I think you could be anything, though. Like, you don't have to make it your abbreviation. Mm. I can hear the crocodiles. Mm hmm. A little fucking bellow. It's kind of ominous with the mist. To be honest, I'm still kind of worried about the fact that I'm standing next to a pile of DNT. Oh, yes. Hang on one minute. Let me just sort that out for you. Oh. Uh -huh. No, I'm joking. To be honest, when, when, when Myrtle showed me this place, that's the first thing I wanted to do, but I'm worried about the house. Be, be worried, because if you do that, I will be forcing you to work within my employee as the. <laughs> I don't know, the construction. Do Extraordinaire. You want? Do you want to? Do you want to? Do, do? Do you want a house renovation? Is that? Is that what you're talking? You're gonna come and yeah. Well, yes. You're gonna come and be here, and you're going to work for me, and you're going to be uh -huh. permanently renovating this building. Oh, maybe. And ignoring maybe anything on that <laughs> you see. Gardening. You Fuck that. The gardener. No, the groundsman. <laughs> yeah, we already have a butler. So. Oh my god. I don't know, but look at him. He looks more like a lumberjack. Yeah, that's true. Thank you. I guess maybe. And lumberjacks are sexy. Don't worry. That's okay. true, that is true. And we do need wood. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, Cece. Oh, no, no, I said you already mean it! Never, we need wood for fires! Yeah, are you trying to? Are you? Are you? Oh, like, is, is, leave me alone. She said we. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she did say specifically said we need wood. Uh, well, you know, we could, we could share a couple. <laughs> Menagerie or Marjorie? <laughs> no, this is to protect Chucky, remember? No, I understand. Mm -hmm. We've had, we're telling people that we're married so that when we do get involved with somebody else, they won't be targeted. Mm -hmm. That we'll just oh each God. be targeted together. Exactly. Fuck's sake. <laughs> it's very smart, I promise. I mean, we're yeah, going to get targeted anyway, whether we like it or not. Wait, hang on. Yes, How much does Declan right. know, Myrtle? Not, not nothing really. Listen, Actually, Cece, I'm not a fucking idiot. You're staying here. What? What's wrong with staying here? Mm -hmm. No, he doesn't know anything. He just knows we're here, and we're. Yeah. That's it, actually. And that we're married. Oh right. So that's, that's well, we're staying, staying here, and we're married, and we're starting up. Employ, no, we're starting up. We just. I, listen. All I'm saying is I miss being rich and in he knows England. That I do not There's... live. He knows There's... I do not live in the West anymore, and I live here. Mm. That's what he knows. I, I know. I know a lot of fucking outlaws or former outlaws have made their way here. I'm, I'm not an idiot, CC, but I also don't give a shit. Well, 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 what? well. We appear to be did? at an impasse. And, and if you did uh, decide to, you know, trust upon 
Declan. He does have a lot of, uh, you know, information and ties to different people. But that's just all I'm saying. I mean, I was actually going to try and convince him to blow up part of the house so I could take him into our employ as a construction worker <laughs> or the groundskeeper. Well, just keep him around idea, and if anyone asks, he says he's doing the renovations. <laughs> uh-huh. He hasn't seen anything untoward here, sir. He's working for a rich lady from England and her wife. Richard, like, okay, as much as the house could look impressive, holy shit, does it not look like you have to be rich to live here right now? I like it, don't get me wrong. It's a fixer-upper, we'll be constantly is, under yes. permanent renovations. Yes, we're ladies of the manor, we'll get it done. Right, does that mean I get to fucking blow up the dynamite every fucking day? Would you, would you like to well, blow up the dynamite? Well, I think that would be the opposite effect of, uh, what you're trying to do Listen, here. Listen, I feel like maybe it's not a fixer-upper and we just need to start with a new clean slate. This, but right, I, you're not totally an actual construction worker, Declan. This is a, this is... Do you know what? Go back to being the lumberjack, Gotwood. I would like you to present us with your wood every day. <laughs> <laughs> the fireplace is. The fireplace, yeah, thank you for clearing that up. Oh Ma'am! <laughs> uh, why is this, why, why does this happen after, for some your, reason, your fucking... Well, I was gonna say, why does this happen after, for whatever fucking reason, Sheila and I decided to talk about a thruple yesterday? Oh, good <laughs> heavens! Not what? Right. There's too many parties involved here for that to be a thing. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's that would just. Full I, I, you'd skip, would be you'd skip thruple and go for fucking orgy. Oh, five point five. I guess. <laughs> but no, I'm just not ready. Queen thruple. You. you mm. uh. Andy and the mermaid <laughs> thruple. Andy and her mermaid boyfriend. Andy's in Guama, by the way. Have fun with that. How did we even get here? Oh, right. Um, Cece was talking about presenting wood. Yes. To us. Well, no, she was talking about you presenting it, really. Hmm. Who's mm -hmm. that? They're back. Oh, it's <laughs> on the tiny Morgan. Mm-hmm. Listen, we'll talk. Business. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Alright, sounds good. One day. Actually, maybe we should wait until Indy gets here and let Indy talk business. Oh god, talking in business with Indy. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm gonna need coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very much Sorry. understand. Mm -hmm. Any, any joy decks? What was that, CC? Is that any joy? You wanna speak up a little bit? Are you... Are you just trying swamp. to get close to my I face? Just, oh, I feel like he's yeah, looking to get punched yeah, in the face again. I was going to say, any joy? Oh, there we go. Uh, no, no, I couldn't find her. I don't know where she is. Oh, I'm going to go back out there and I'll have another look a bit later. I'm sure she'll be all right. She'll come around. I just, I'll apologise. Well, she'll probably apologise. Hey, it'll be fine. It's all right. Here's the thing with apologies, Dex. They don't fix what you broke. Oh, I ain't broke. Not there, no. Mm -hmm. mm. Well, how about I throw a plate on the ground and apologise to it? It will still be a very broken plate. Well, I think that's a little bit different than getting your head smacked off a pillar, but yeah, sure. Mm. If I was to ask anyone else that was present for what happened there, would they tell me exactly what you told me in the same light? Say it. Yeah, sure. Ask him. Go ahead. No, no, go on. Do, do, hang on, someone's pulling a weird face. Go on, Captain. Oh, uh. I don't think it's my place to really comment on this. No, but please do. Cece, does he have your uh, can, can, can he say? You can, you can, you can speak candidly, Captain. If you ask me, I agree with the sentiment of what he said, not the way in which he said it. I do agree that he should be mad. No one likes getting their head bashed off a pillar. And I especially when she, especially when he told her to stop when it was getting too far, he punched her a couple of times. She was pushing him closer to the pillar, continuing to punch him. He said, "Right, stop now, stop now." In which she then bashed his head off the pillar, and then she, even when he was on the ground, proceeded to go try and get some alligator teeth to pull his eye out and replace him with alligator teeth. Now, Wait, sorry, you didn't tell yeah, me that, that was bit. Kind of funny though. Don't get me wrong. It could it be funny business. under other pretenses apart from the fact that she bashed his head off the pillar. 
which I think was a bit too far. Now, she did apologise for it. I don't think she meant it. However, you need to be careful when you're messing about because sometimes accidents happen and Ooh, they can be quite this? dangerous. Oh. Is that her? No, it's uh, not. No. That's dark. That, that, yeah, I was going to say, that's Dex's face I'm looking at very closely, which is a very charming <laughs> face to look at. But uh, <laughs> thank, thank you, Cece. But I do think, again, to summarise it all, I think... He was in the wrong for the way in which he said it, not what he said. And I think she was in the wrong for taking it too far. That is my personal opinion on the matter. Uh, I agree. Thank you, uh, Captain. Mm -hmm. Quick, Dark. everyone, just pretend like you're... What? Hello, Doc. Hello. How's Hello, it Doc. <laughs> Good Hello. Hello. Yes, the doc. The only man you can send to a paradise island who comes back within freaking moments. Yeah, that was a bit of an experience, wasn't it? You right, Efficiency. Doc? Yeah. Do I recognise this guy opposite? Oh, no. Uh, doc, oh, this, is, uh, this is Declan. Um, he may be becoming a provider of wood for us. <laughs> And maybe be a bit of a handyman wood. around the building. Provider of wood. Oh, I only met him so today, and now he's going to be the provider of fucking this. wood. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, well, I thought Dex was Six. offering to do that for you. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, I've got some gems to go store. <laughs> boy, oh boy. I mean, uh, I just, I just, I'm seeing two people uh, go all fucking tomato. So, I mean, I feel like there might be yeah. something to choose to that. Yeah, 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 I was going to say, you know, the, the going bright red sort mm -hmm. of signifies uh, something. Sorry, I think, I'm gonna go well, no, there's a, there's a now break of um, uh, tuberculosis, and I, I think I might have uh, tetanus. That, that was a what? bad way to phrase no, it. That's what Mr. Chesterfield said <laughs> the other day. He talked about <laughs> relieving himself, and I uh -huh. thought that... Yeah, nice. Bad, bad way to phrase I'm it. I'm gonna take a piss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yourself you is something you, you know. Oh, fuck. Mm -hmm. yeah, you know, after a very tense day. So, <laughs> fuck the hell. It doesn't even have to be a tense day. That, you just that do it to say good morning. Oh, yeah, as well, mate. Fucking hell, that kid. He, he's something else. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, he's a good kid, but fucking hell. Who, Dex? Yeah, he's a good kid, but fucking hell. He's Stop calling him a kid. He's older than me. How He's not older than me. Uh, I think actually, but um, we might be around about the same, early twenties. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like, how old are... mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What constitutes what early twenties? Uh, older than twenty, younger than twenty-five. Oh God, I don't no. have too much of my early twenties left. The early part of, of yeah, the twenties. So I understand. Bitch, I'm gonna I'm gonna go yeah. into my mid twenties next month. Yeah, I'm old enough to be most of your father's fucking hell. <laughs> mm. Okay, Dad. Don't worry, I, I do not start with that. No, you're right. That's Doc's position. I spent all of two days ago getting flirted with by somebody that could be my father. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, two, two, two crows. No. Oh, I see. Yeah. Tukuru is 49 years old, but my god. It's alright, Jack Catherman was like 80 million years old when I met him. Hmm. That might be an exaggeration. I mean, I'd hope so. I, it, it, it's definitely a, an exaggeration. It's, uh, Do you mind expect somebody to be fucking, Jack you know, back know dust and, got it. well, just Basically, just about dust after that long. Why, how old are you? Declan? 24. Like, still got it set up? There Fucking we go. Fucking hell. Oh, you're one year older than me. Chucky's 18. Oh, shit. I'm more uh -huh. than double your age. Right. Fucking hell. <laughs> you know. Are you okay? After Are you feeling better now? The relieving yeah, of relieved. oneself? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. alright. You know, I thought it was a bad idea to say that. I just uh, learned words from Mr. There was gunshot on a horse just right up in that direction. Yeah. Oh, no, no. What? The hunting Why? gators. The hunting gators. Who's that? Mm -hmm. I shot a bird, apparently. Oh, it's a bird, is it? Mm. She's on the other side of the river. I wouldn't worry about it for now. Alright, yeah, sure. 
can't say this seems like a pretty common thing. I was expecting spot. Woodfall, what is this? I don't sorry, know, first time I met him as well. Oh, sorry, Declan. Mm. Um, this uh, lovely young man here is um, Dex. Um, yeah, the, the, the other not so young man is the Doc. Uh, and uh, did you meet you met Costas already, haven't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 I'm a uh, Declan McGray. He uh, spends a lot of time with the uh, the tribes up in Wapiti. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, well. What do you mean by wood? What's he doing here? Oh. He's oh. A right now. Man in Indies. Oh. Okay. And and, and mine and mine. Mm. Yes. Yes. In CCs. But I was thinking of you know seeing if I can employ him to do some work on the manor for us or. Seeing as he yeah, crafts well, bows and whatnot, he's good with his hands. That, and we do need a, a frequent supply design. of. We do need a, a frequent supply of wood. <laughs> Dark. I, I mean it. We've got so many fireplaces in there that we need to be able to, you know, fill up. Mm -hmm. With wood. Yeah, I understand. I get it. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> How much wood do you reckon you could bring here? Fuck sake. I don't know. <coughs> I'm, really I'm just now. talking time frames, you know. Oh. Just want to know how much uh. wood you can do quickly, bring, you know. It's a bit of my heater with you doing it. I'm trying to think this year. I'm not laughing at me, though. I don't get it. Dex. Look, what? sometimes it's about the quality of the wood, Dex. Or how fast it comes. Exactly. Okay. okay. Well, that's what we're saying, so This we're... is my wife. <laughs> I'm just gonna stare up at the sky for a moment. Mm -hmm. oh, fuck, oh. is that noise? <laughs> this is a fucking weird ass bird. That's a weird bird. <laughs> oh, I want to get out for a long time. I mean, hey, you know. Anyway, look. Um, I, I don't go for any. I don't know who's got to call. Actual, you know, talk actual business here. I'm just trying to. I'm, I'm trying to figure uh -oh. it out. See, see, you You're wanna, trying to you figure need... out his wood. You need to hand up. No. I'm okay. Right. Sorry. I mean, anyway. on a good day, how much would we talking? Oh my god. <laughs> how much do you want? <coughs> as much as you can give. Oh, no. I'm alright in the wood department of getting off of my <laughs> thank you. Anyway, look. Alright. Okay. I'm gonna go speak uh, to the duck. See, he's gonna yeah. get moody. Mm -hmm. Hi. Do you know what? You are all bad influences on me. I wouldn't use you partaking jokes like this, but fucking hell. I feel like the only one who doesn't, so I have to join in. Listen, if you... <laughs> I wonder a couple times I've gotten to spend some time with CC. I... You get used to it. Shut up. Do you know what the worst thing is? It's not even intentional. Mm -hmm. It's just like everything out of my mouth is misconstrued poorly and incorrectly. Mm -hmm. Maybe. I don't mean this in the You might need to work possible. on rephrasing a couple yeah. of things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe you need work it's on very inappropriate things. to ask for wood in front of your wife. Oh, right, yes, sorry, my love. <laughs> Would you like to ask the wood? Well, you're Edward? married now. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, I've been away for two days. If that. You know, what's mine no, is yours, so... and what's yours is mine, so. Jesus fucking Christ. Sharing's caring. Well, so, so, so your wood is now her wood? No. There's plenty of wood to go around. No, 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 no. <laughs> fucking hell. I mean, at my least if it's eight, you can split it into four. That house, and it is yeah. mine. <laughs> your wood is in that house and fast asleep, and no one's touching that wood. That wood yep, stays that there. that wood is reserved. Some might say that that wood chucks wood because a wood chuck could chuck wood. I mean, hey, from from uh, from what I've gathered, CC, your wood is standing on the dock right now. What? No, no, no! I don't, I, I don't, no, no, no. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have, I don't have wood. Thank you. About Dexter. Oh, I mean, because you know, who doesn't have a have a good fucking papa complex, fucking. <laughs> Papa Doc. Oh, I assure you, I do not have the right piping for Doc. <laughs> oh no! Oh fuck it up. Oh, maybe God, I should do the right I have to drainage introduce... constructions. Does that mean I have to introduce two crews to Doc? I mean, you could do, but Doc is in a very loving relationship with a oh. with their partner, uh, Todd. Mm. 
Oh shit. Oh, dogs with Todd, I didn't even know mm, that one. Yes. Mm. No, I learned God. something new every day. Todd is the, uh, the housekeeper. Oh yeah, Todd, mm -hmm. Todd's the, uh, the, the, the groundskeeper, the, the caretaker. No, house, housekeeper, like, you know, the maid. Caretaker. Mm. That's, what, that's, what, that's what Todd preferred when I asked him what role ah, he was. Fair. fair enough. So, so you saw like the groundskeeper, and well, I'm not too keen on that one. I was like, what about caretaker? And, well, oh yeah, that's about. So what, what about you, Cap? Because I've got to offload two crews on someone so he can stop hitting on me. No, thank you. I do not swing in that general direction. <laughs> you know, that general direction, but slightly wider taco, scope. You're all good. Taco, not hot dog. What? <laughs> I'm, 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 uh... Oh, <laughs> these fucking guys. What has this devolved I into? I said I'm well, more of a burrito the... rather than a taco person myself. <laughs> mm. well, what, what do you have in a burrito? That was the question. Me? Welcome to the manor. We are all very passionate about food types, apparently. Apparently, yeah. <laughs> And um, all of the me. equipment needed to cook it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, Christ alive. American Degeneracy of the highest mm. regard. What do you like in your burrito? Meat. Is that, um, you know, is that is it well done meat? Is Fuck it rare? Is it medium oh, rare? How do you, how do you oh, like it? It depends on the time of day. Mm -hmm. Depends how you cook it, really. Mm -hmm. Preparation is very important. What's the general consensus? What does it mean? Um, <laughs> I hate you right now. What? Oh, uh, Honest to God. Oh, that's another train. I wonder uh, if it's a high. Yeah. Miss Cabo. One second, I heard a train. I heard the train. Huh. We heard a train, but we cannot see a train. Bollocks. Sorry. Heard a train, I'm but glad you're having a good time, but we have some business to talk about. Oh, right, yeah, sorry. Would you like to speak about it here? Yeah. We're up to 50 rubies, 32 sapphires, 42 diamonds, still 9 emeralds. Oh my. Well, very good. Yeah, I've had to expand the gem storage that I'm holding, so... Uh, not sure how many of the guns I'm going to be able to hold as well. Probably two more, but we're going to get more than two in, hopefully. I have some funds if you need them. I don't know if you gave Chucky the money for the guns yet. I haven't given Jeff the money for the guns yet, no. Alright, I can do that then whenever he's uh, around if I see him. Alright, perfect. Uh, as for some storage, I probably have some in my in my own personal, you know, trunk. In fact, I should probably go and else, fetch uh, that from Rhodes at some well, point. Anything else happened yesterday we need to go over, or is that all? Right, yes. Uh, so I have a slight concern about Indy's romantic choices. Uh, it's become apparent to the person that they are fond of is a uh, nasty, nasty snitch. Who is this? Uh, a gentleman named the Revenant. Ooh, I can hear the train again. Oh, uh, how do you know they're a snitch? Because we went for a kayaking trip earlier and he saw someone drop a body and go, he went straight to the law. We weren't aware that that was what he was doing because the last I'd checked the Revenant was a, uh, a criminal. Oh, is that is that a is that a high value? No. Oh, God it looks like a passenger chain to me. It's just a pay. It's just a passenger. That's a shame. Not that we were going to grab it today. I just mean I'd like to know how often and frequently we're likely to see them. Yeah. No, oh, that's a good place to keep an eye on them. I know, right? Anyway, uh, no, they they they'd shot off somewhere when we asked Indy where they'd gone. Indy said to go and report it to law. We did pull into one side and say that that is going to be a problem. 
Uh, but none of us have actually said anything about what we're doing to them, and Indy has said they also haven't, but... <clears throat> what do you mean, doing to them? Hmm, what do you mean? Sorry? Well, what we're doing to them, what do you mean? What? No, I said... You said we haven't decided what we're doing to them. No, we haven't anything. told them anything. And Indy also hasn't told them anything. That's what I mean. But for the moment, I haven't quite... No, sorry, I haven't quite decided the best way to approach the situation because it's... Well, it's a loose thread. Just waiting yeah, to be well, pulled. Depends how much trust you have in Indy. And, uh, well... Indy can see who they want, but if they want to bring anyone back here... I mean, oh, yes. my, no, both, my both myself and Myrtle made it very clear to Indy that they are not to bring them back here. Well, my standard for people bringing people back here is if you're bringing someone here and they hear or see something and go to the law, is your responsibility and you should be the one that's going to shoot them. Right, yes, no, I have made that very clear. Uh, also, uh, Edgar, um, I mean, this is a conversation we could have tomorrow, or maybe not tomorrow, but next time we have a good chance to talk, but, uh, just be careful with what you share with him as clientele in the, the meantime he is very well known for ratting to get his own way and to get out of things he's the oh, sort he's of person well, that then. should he get caught he'll trade us in to get himself out of something yeah one of these new lot then hmm? one of these new lot then oh there's new what behind us no, he's one of these new lot then. Oh, outlaws. yes, Edgar. In fact, I believe he doesn't even refer to himself as an outlaw or a criminal. He calls himself a bandito. Or actually, no, he, he calls, calls himself, himself a, king a king now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right, well. We'll, uh, we'll deal with him as long as he's quiet on things where we haven't let him know too much. He doesn't even know where we run out of, so... No, exactly. He'd actually be very good to, to, to deal with in, in the meantime, but uh, there's, 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 I'm, I'm just looking to acquire a bit more information than I might propose something to you that I'd really like your advice on before anything gets acted on. Right. But yes, I'm just waiting. I'm waiting on a, a, a contact to speak to first. Yeah. Was that all? I think so, yes. I think so. Right. Oh, actually, no. Uh, what did Dex tell you whilst you were over here? Nothing. Just about him getting his head slammed against a pillar by Delaney. Right, and did he tell you that he then told her to fuck off back to the swamps and sent a woman that, because of him, knows almost too much about what we're doing? And sent her away angry and hurt? How much has he told her? I have no idea, but she does loiter around and lurk, so... And That's I do worry that Dex... You need to have with him, then. Well, uh... Fine. Unless you want me to do it all for you. No, I don't want you to do it all for me. I can do it, but... No, I, well, I've already had the conversation with him slightly. I just mean if this woman is a problem. I, I hate to say it, but if he can't handle it, we're going to have to handle well, that one ourselves as well. I, uh, I'll be there for the conversation if you'll have me. Well, like I said, I've already, I have spoken to him about it, and I've told him that if he can't get it under control and handled, then we will do it. Yeah. All right. I didn't know how much she knew. No, I'm not 100% sure either, actually. I should probably ask him about that. I trust him, but I don't trust his nervous no, his disposition. Mouth is too loose. Uh, it's well... He's yes, a bit too nervous true. right now when he talks mm. to people. Uh, do you know what his big secret is? No. For fuck's sake. This woman has some sort of hold over him, and I want to know what it is. Because mm. I don't believe it's the one that he told me. What did he tell you? Oh, that he murdered his father. Oh, well. No, I'm not sure that'll be it. No, exactly, but yes. I feel a bit terrible because I think to him... <clears throat> but yes, yeah, so if those uh, trains come by... Interrupt hmm? anything, am I? No, not at all. We're just talking about the trains coming by. We're trying to keep an eye out. To see how regularly the uh, the high ones, the the high value ones, come through. 
Yeah, yeah, sure. No, I just thought they're uh, they're having a conversation. I uh, I was just speaking to uh, Declan about things. I, I'm sorry, I won't interrupt. I just uh, no, letting no, no, them. No, 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 you're more than welcome. No, no, it's fine. Oh. We were pretty, we were done anyway. So. Oh yeah, sure, sure. We're just catching up about Guama. Yeah, Guama. I did a guana. Yeah, something you said you would never eat, but you ate a guana. Yes. Yeah, yeah. The uh, duck. Uh, well, we 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 got two, didn't we, duck? Yeah. Well, I got two. Well, yeah, duck got two. I mean, uh, as far as it goes, it was a little bit stiff. You know. It was it was strange. Right, I'm not having a fourth conversation about eating iguanas, so I'll leave you to it. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. You already spoke about it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <All right>. oh. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, I, I didn't know you'd already spoke about it. Mm, yeah, it's fine. Well, what about these uh, trains and CC? What, what do you think? Oh, well, I feel like it's the best place to try and figure out when and if and how frequently the, the high-value trains come through. It's not worth robbing the passenger trains because, well, we're not robbing people, but the big high-value ones... Well, we're robbing the company at that point. We will piss off the train workers because that that money is what pays their way. But yeah, yeah. Well, the thing is, I mean, how do we know? I mean, you know, if it's a train worth robbing, I mean, we'd, how would we know when that train's coming in? We'd have to do our do our uh, research, right? Right. Yes. Well, that's sort of why I keep running out every time I hear a train. So far, I've only seen passenger trains come through. You reckon it would work? You reckon we could pull that off? Oh, well, I've already been a part of two of those types of heists. Oh, you have, CC. Well, oh, both accidentally, but... And how did that go? It go good? Uh, the first time, uh, I was an unwittingly passive observer to the situation, and the second time was why the law pulled me in to talk to me fairly recently. Well, at least you didn't get caught. No, it was fine, yes. You got experience. Well, it's... though I have experience pulling a gun on a member of train staff, I actually haven't robbed one personally myself. I've just aided and abetted in one twice. Well, now you're going to have to try and plan one eventually, CC. I know, but that's the thing. We need to figure out when and where they're coming around. Both times these were very impromptu. And I didn't like the impromptu nature of it because that leaves room for things to go very, very wrong. Yeah, I mean, uh, luckily the, the bank the bank job didn't go... The bank job didn't go bad, well, for a couple of people, but even still, but we got away with enough. And... That job was a success, Dex. Even with two people going to Sisica, they went... They did their time. They didn't. They didn't snitch or inform on us. Everyone got paid, and no one died. That we know of. Oh no! Yeah, no one died. It and was, they uh... have no idea who was exactly behind it. So, success. We're, you know, one for one. You should be. Yeah, you should be proud of yourself as well. You, 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 you arranged a lot of that. You, you, you made it work. I think we'd have done it without no, you. I haven't done anything but support you all. You all have something to be proud of, not me. Well, I'm not sure I wouldn't have been able to do it without your support, CC, so there's that. You're doing a real good job. Right, Dex, you don't have to blow hot air up my ass. It's fine. Blow what up your ass? Hot air. I ain't blowing hot air up your ass. I can give you a compliment every now and again, right? No, it's no. I, I probably best that you don't. Why? Well, because I they go on deaf ears with me. Compliments make me awkward. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I gave you a few compliments. Right. Yes, and I'm pretty sure I make it awkward. Oh, right, if you don't want me to compliment you, I won't. That's all right. I appreciate it. All right, then. Uh, uh, well, yeah. Uh, well, you, 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 uh, you better get back. Um. Right. Actually, I have a question. Sure. Uh, about Delaney. 
How much do you, you talk to her about what we do? Like, how much does she know? What are you asked that? What? Just, I'm just curious. How much does she know? I ain't told her nothing about what we actually do. She just knows that we do business. That's it. Right. Okay, she... well, that's fine. Why don't you trust me? No, I do trust you, Dex. That's why I'm asking you. If I didn't trust you, I'd ask someone else to find out for me. Yeah. All right. Um. Well, she. Uh, she. She don't. She don't. She doesn't know much. Apart from you know where we stay. I know, but she's also welcome to stay here. It's just be careful I told about her that. plans and whatnot around her. If you're going to piss this woman off, we really can't be having her know any more than she already does. I wouldn't tell her anything that she shouldn't... Well, I wouldn't tell her anything that she don't need to know. She don't need to know anything, really. We, we had a, just a normal conversation about things, that's all. I ain't going to go into detail about it, about the jobs that we do. I mean, she, she's got a, a little bit of an idea, I guess, of what we do. But... Right, yes. She's... I can speak to her and... I'll apologise for what I said. There's just so much going on right now, you know? Yes, there is a lot going on. It's, uh... It's all a lot faster than I'd hoped it would go. Um, yeah, me too. I wasn't expecting to have expanded quite so quickly either, to the point where now we really do need to start focusing on getting the civilian front up and running, because otherwise we're just a bunch of criminals hiding at a place. Well, yeah, it's that and people bringing other people in that I ain't never fucking met before. Right, Which is fine if you know him. I get that. I understand, but... I mean, there was that fella back there. I mean, he seems all right. I don't know him. Which is so probably I can't really make well, proper Declan. judgment. Yeah, you know him, so it's all right, yeah? No, I trust him well enough to know that if he does anything to jeopardise this, he knows that he won't survive it. Well, that, that's what I mean. That's fine, ain't it? But, you know, you know, I'll come down here to the, to the manor and she's just done a peer with, with him. And I don't have a clue who he is. I mean, he's fine now, you know. Obviously, now I know that you know him, but right, it's just yes. people here well, all the time, people that Myrtle, I don't even know. Myrtle has been brought fully into the, the fold, so we have to learn to trust her judgment as well. She seems all right, I guess. She, what about but, her? No, I don't mean it either. Like no, she, no, no, she... actually, I, I generally, I've asked everyone these sorts of questions about each other. What's your general opinion? Like, genuinely. This, this isn't a trick question. You're oh, not going to be in trouble for expressing your opinion. <laughs> you gonna? I'm going to be in trouble from no, you. You're not. No, I just. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Look, uh, she's all right. She, she she seems nice. She seems quite. Uh... What I have noticed is that I think she's really, uh, really in love with uh, our fella that she's always with. The way I'm she checking, looks at him. Yes. Yeah, the way she looks at him, the way she speaks to him. Um, uh, I think they've got something there yeah, that's nice to speak, but even still, I don't know about him. Hi, Yoga. He talks a lot. He talks a hell of a lot. And he might know things and he might be good at what he does, but I don't know. He's been a part of a lot of things from what I can hear, what I know. Some about the dead and gang or whatever you call them. I don't know what it called. Started with the dead ends, yeah. Dead ends, yeah. No, I don't. I don't know. I'm just saying I don't want us to invite too many people here. Being a part of these things. Well, we trust Myrtle if you do. I don't know if you mm -hmm. do, but. Well, that's what I can see. That's all see, I can really see. I can just in? see that she's really. Oh, no! Is it down? Shit, so really, you really, get kicked out. Uh, you know, loves him. And that's her focus, right? So, 
anything happens to him, you don't know if she's going to go buck fucking wild. And if anything happens to her, he might go fucking wild as well. So I just keep an eye on that because I, uh, I don't know how they actually feel about that kind of thing. Oh, I don't know. This is probably why Doc keeps saying to me things, oh, no, you know, like... And I mean, it's like, you know, I, I don't know, he just says you should never involve, you know, relationships and business. I don't know, all this, I don't know. Fuck right. knows. Well, the Doc has their partner here, so we're not going oh, yeah, to see what the Doc what has I... to say about Myrtle or, or Chucky's relationship. Yeah, it, sure. Especially as I'm actually quite interested in bringing Chucky in to the, you know, the manor. Officially, much like Myrtle. Yeah, sure, you can. Sure, call CC. Myrtle, she's all right. Yeah, I'll get to know her. Chucky, I think he's a dick, but yeah, sure. Uh, why, why do not? you think he's a dick? He talks too much. He's always talking and, you know, pulling out some weird... I mean, he pulled out some weird instrument the other day and started playing it, and I don't know. He's, he, show, he shows off. Maybe I don't like a show off. Before I'm surprised. you say, I ain't fucking no. jealous. I... No, I wasn't about to say you're jealous. What would you have to be jealous of? I'm, I, I'm surprised. I genuinely thought you and Chucky would get on. Oh well, no, I don't know. I, I, it's not that. I'd never be horrible to him or, or nothing. I'd no, never no, no, say no. That. I mean, I was. Uh, well, I'll be incredibly honest. I'm very fond of Chucky, in a sisterly way. And I was really hoping to yeah. find him a brother, especially since he's lost his family when he's had to leave the West. We all lost something, CC. Well, we've all lost things, which is why we should really try to find them in each other. Yeah. But I'm not going to force you to get on with the man. No, it's not. Uh, I ain't never going to no, no, you know cause what? a disagreement. It, no, no, no. It, no it's one of those things. Now I say nine times out of ten I get it right. This might be one of those times out of ten I got it wrong. I just, I thought you two would get along like a house on fire. Maybe we will. Eventually. I don't know. Just keep your mind open for, for it, or your heart open for it too. Just because I think you two will get on very well. I just think sometimes it's a little bit, uh, I don't know. He talks to me as if I ain't done things, you know. I was riding with him in roads, making sure they weren't going to get shot after that sully fell were came around to the manor. I know he's talking to me as if I didn't know what I was doing. Maybe I took it wrong, I don't know, but, you know, he's saying, oh, you know, about the, about the bank job and whatnot. I mean, I tried to do one of them, you know, them, whatever you call them, the dials, but that wasn't my job anyway. I got roped into doing one of the dials and I was meant to have my gun on the... No, I on a, know. ...on a poor this bastard is... in the corner. Dex, no one's, no one's bringing that up and no one's accusing no, he, me of doing anything wrong. did, though. He did, and he made me feel like I wasn't, I didn't do a good enough job, even though I was the one that had to jump from fucking ducks horse onto a carriage and be the shit out of someone egos, to get guys, off of it. The boys are going to fight. But uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm overreacting. I think I need some time after that. I ain't been the same. I ain't felt the same. So, there's too much going on. Right. I get worked up. No, I know you do. Do we have to take you to, like, up. one of those, you know, fancy houses with ladies? Do we need to take you to go to the Tongue Chantress lady in Rhodes? What? <laughs> well, you're just you're getting all pent up and worked up. Maybe we need to find you one of those release-type options. No. No, CC. <laughs> what do you don't. mean, no, CC? I... It's not what I want. Right, well... Fine. Look, I don't know how I feel at the moment. And you're real busy. Look, you know the other, the other day, Valentine? Oh, I got drunk. Oh, did you now? Yeah, no, you were there, remember? Oh, right. Uh, uh, I do no. remember. You were there. Outside Valentine, outside the saloon. And I said... He doesn't remember. 
I know what I do when I, I weren't that drunk. I, I remember things. No, she generally, she doesn't remember. It was too much for her brain and her brain just oh, went, nope. Look at me, don't look like that. Are you... No, Chucky, I, I'm not quite sure what you're referring to. Genuinely. Just call me Chucky. I did, and I'm so sorry, Dex. See, fucking hell, there we go. I might as well just leave Chucky. It can be my, my fucking, ah, uh, no. Look, 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 when we were seeing Valentine not too long ago, and uh, I got real drunk, and I said some things outside to you, outside the saloon, you know, I said that, no. you know, you meant a lot to me, remember? And you ran off, you, well, you walked off. No, I. All right. No, I, I, I know. I generally, I don't know. That's all right. Okay. Don't remember. It's all right. Maybe you had a drink as well. No, it's fine. Look. No, look, I don't. I don't drink, Chucky. You call me Chucky again. I'm so sorry. I. Don't worry about it. No, it's, no, it's no. Right. I don't mean it. I just. Dex, no. All I was gonna say is that whatever no, I said. No, it wasn't then, me, Darth. I did mean, all right, whether or not, no, I do mean it, and my head's been all over the place right now, and I know you've got a job to do, and I get that, and you, I didn't think that you were going to actually, you know, be leading this whole thing, and it worries me that you're going to get hurt, I've never worried about anyone before, ever, 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 my, ever in my life, never, I never worried about anyone. <sighs> Forget about it. And never worried about who? Never worried about me, Dex. I'm going to take a ride. And what did you say to him? I didn't say anything to him other than that I didn't remember a conversation that we supposedly had. I mean it. I, I generally, I don't, I don't remember it. it I... I, I, I don't know if he's he's imagined it or if. if... What conversation is he talking about? Uh, it's something about how he he was saying about his feelings and that they they mean he meant what he said and I I don't I did he maybe he just did he say it in his head is he dreaming it? Mm hmm. I sorry. Um, you can't have him riding off like this because well, of I... the, the relationship okay, between you two. Break in from my back. Shit! Would would you like to go? Oh, right. yes, okay. No, I'm not going to go after him. Oh, sorry, I didn't hear any of that. Oh, uh, we're just going to go to Rhodes and come right back. We're going to check the telegrams. Okay, piggy. Have fun. Oh, can I ask someone to bring you back a stew? Would that I'm be okay? Sure. Needed anything, uh, yeah, I probably want to spill one for me as well, if that's all right. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Coffee or anything? Uh, no, I'm, I'm good for that. Thank you. All right. All right. Yeah, sounds good. Yo, have fun, stay safe. Hey. Need to see about getting someone over there on that gold pan, by the way. Is there a gold pan over there? Yeah, right there, within sight of here. Just on that little island there. Oh, right, Actually, yeah. Well, I have, have someone... gold pan before there. Have you? I mean, I yeah. had gold pan before once. Yeah, it's pretty shit, but, uh, you know, it's within sight of the land, so you want to make some money and still be at the, uh, the manor here. It's not a terrible uh, way to go, is it? No. Anyway, you can't be riding off like this. This is the exact reason why having relationships between people in groups is bad. Right, yes, if I this know, happens Doc. Again, like, I know you know. It needs to be made clear to him. Do you want to make it clear to him? Want me to be there? Do you want me to make it clear to him? No, I, I, no, it's fine. I've, I've made, I. It's Obviously fine. Obviously, just... it isn't clear to him. No, wait, Doc. It's clear to him that he can't do it. He must surely know by now. I know for a fact you keep talking to him about it, and I know that I've definitely spoken to him about it, and I've Ms. told him Cabrera. if he does anything to jeopardise this, I will Ms. put Cabrera. him down like a dog. He just jeopardised this. Right, yes, but that's not because of that. That's because I don't seem to remember a conversation. A conversation to do with a relationship. No, it, I... Yes, well... It's the same thing. That can't happen. Right, yes. 
Feelings or no feelings, I don't care. I just want this to work. Me too. I hate it because if Dex had more a, handcuffs. A, we get we do well, yeah, well, the thing is that's oh, oh, I've only got one pair. I don't uh, mind robbing a lawman. No, I know you don't mind robbing a lawman, but I'd really like to try and keep the heat off of us and see if there's anyone else that may already have a small stash of them. I mm, who do you know might who sells things? Might I managed know to, someone. Uh, managed to save up four grand currently. We need any money for anything. Right, perfect. Um, well, oh, well, that's impressive, Doc. Thanks, Miss Gabor. That's very sorry. I'm fucking with you, or I calm down. Okay, sorry. I'm. This is. Lasted, I know. I'm trying my best to just pull it back together. Everything's fine. I don't know who this guy is that you've invited in. Oh, Declan, uh... no, that's uh... So I was quite surprised to see him here myself, but I do know him. He is what I would call a criminally adjacent. He knows the merits of keeping his mouth shut. Um, right, he's actually well... quite friendly as well. Okay, well... I'm... Not that I'm saying you haven't done this. I'm just going to say that would need to be made clear to him. And also, whenever there's anyone here, but me, Dex, Chesterfield, anyone like that who knows things, doesn't know, needs to be made clear to us who they are and what we're talking to them about and how much we yeah. can say. Mm -hmm. Same thing with everyone you've brought so far. We need to know where Myrtle stands, you already told us. Mm -hmm. We know where Indy stands. Mm -hmm. That's all right. If anyone else arrives here that you know, we need to know where they stand. Right. Well, try, Costas, uh, yeah. I'm still keeping an eye on. He seems to have a... Well, I think he's favouring us at the moment for a potential staying around. But he might have a bit more to prove before that can become a thing. And then, of course, there's Chucky, but with, with Merkel, I've just sort of assumed Chucky is someone we should probably bring in as well. He's got very good ideas, so I would like him to... Oh, I like him. Dex doesn't. Why doesn't he like Chucky? Mm, he thinks he's a, a, a asshole, was it? Or a dickhead? Something. Bit of a dick? I think he thinks it's Chucky never talks too much. never stopped him from liking me. I, I think it's two young men of similar um, age and similar skill sets. May I suggest you send them out on a job together then? That was exactly my plan. Good thinking. I just need to think of the job now. Um, I, well, I, I know I said I don't really want to rob people and I don't really want you robbing lawmen, but I think Chucky might be happy to do something like that, possibly. I really just don't want to... No, I think that might be a bit too deep of an end. I to think so, it might be too, yes. Well, so the, one of the reasons Dex doesn't like Chucky is because he felt like Chucky was talking to him as if he didn't have any experience. I think Dex is feeling a bit patronised and undervalued. And I don't know how I can mm. make him feel valued because it, it can't be me that does it. Not it with can. his feelings the way they are. Not directly. But you can give him a job to do something that you know that he can do, that he will do, and then when he does it, you say well done, and you give him well, another well, job. Well, that's the thing, Doc. I don't know what he can do other than mope. What do we need? Mm, what do we need? Well, we need civilians at the moment. We need we civilians. Trustworthy civilians to come along. We need up. handcuffs. We need guns. We need gems. You can give him something that we need and send him out to get it. Doesn't matter how he gets it. He can go and earn the money and buy it. He can go and find someone to buy it off. He can go and rob it off someone if he really wants to. But give him something that he needs to go and get you and us as the group. Right. Tell him when he gets it to hand it to me or Chesterfield rather than him being able to give it to you to get praise directly. And then tell Chesterfield or me if he does come back with it to give him, well, tell him he's done a good job. That way he's starting to do things for the group, not just for you, and he's also growing his confidence in doing things by himself. Yes. 
Anyway, how's the house doing? Oh, right, well... Oh, I never met that man that you spoke to spoke about the other day. If you have his telegram, it might be worth giving... Well, we'll, uh, we'll sort that out in the week. We've got time. It's going to be in one of my books, so I think it's on my other mm. horse, to be honest. I, um, I spoke to a lady from the bathhouse earlier today as well. Um, She just... Every time I see her, she's there on her own, just standing. Um, yep. Quite, you, you know exactly who I'm talking about, don't you? Oh, she's given me a bath before. I think that... Uh... Was it a brown haired lady? Mm hmm. Very softly spoken. Yeah, it sounds like anything would break her. Pardon? Sorry, say that again? Yeah, it sounds like anything might break her. Yes, her. I highly doubt anything would break her. I think she might be secretly very dangerous. No. No. Um, I think she's absolutely wonderful, and I would very much like to get her as part of the household. So I'm 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 starting to think embracing a certain uh outward presentation is the best way to keep uh, those of us doing the crime very safe. Yeah, we've already discussed this the house roles. We're going to yes, need people who are working here who aren't actually working with us who we don't exactly. tell what we're doing. Oh, I thought maybe I could try and uh, convince her to come in. I did get her telegram under the pretense of wanting to order some baking goods from her. Why don't you order those baking goods to this house and we can have a conversation with her? Yes, what, right now? No, I'm going to have to go to sleep right now. Right, yes. Oh, that's fine. Well, no, I actually sent her a telegram saying if she's ever got a lot of things to do, she could reach out and uh, I would happily send someone to, to, to accompany her here. Oh, I might have to build a bit more trust before she bites on that. Right, yes. Well, I'll, I'll put a delivery in for, for here. Yeah, I'm not going to be awake tomorrow. Is there anything you need from me? No, you're not awake tomorrow, did you say? Uh, I might be awake very early on, but then as the night goes on, you're going to lose me. No, uh, I, I probably need to get some really long sleep in myself, actually, so I, I don't think I am going to be yeah, about so you tomorrow. You be around early when I'm going to be around. Oh, shit. No, I don't think I'm going to be around. Well, I might be around a little bit earlier in the day, actually, depending on how early is early. Free lunchtime, um, I could probably be around. Well, I'd say between lunch and evening. Ah, uh, no. That'll be I'm when afraid. I'll be around. I'm afraid I'll be doing one of those nice deep sleeps, so it won't be until Tuesday. How beautiful that horse is. I know, it's a lovely big dumpy horse and I love it. so fucking thick right anyway i'm gonna go to bed right yes go to bed this I'm is exactly why dex riding off right now compromises this entire situation because i'm leaving you alone now i don't want to leave you alone but he's fucked off right well i will head into roads where there are people and i will send him a telegram and get his ass back to i'm as as going possible. to go into roads with you then come on but you need to put your head down if you want to get your horse to follow us, you can. Or, well, you can ask the stable boy, I guess. I should probably get the horse to. You know what? He'll still be here when I come back. Yep, as long as you've Worst got case scenario, to bring I'll back walk here. here. You're not going to walk here, right? There are fucking panthers in these forests. Fine, well, I'll go hunt Dex down and use him as a human meat shield. Probably a good usage. No, we're not, we're not, that's not the use that we're going to, he's not, he's not cannon that fodder. That was a joke, Miss Edwell. Oh. You forget I've worked with him before. Right, yes. There weren't any ladies for him to be uh, distracted by her before, though. Well, you'd have thought mad. Lady. Well, the right. only ladies around were Scott's wives, and my God, if he had fucking touched them. Lost right. both of his hands. You see his horse. I don't know. No, maybe I can't remember. What you know, if, like. Do you know? Do you not know what horse he rides? No, Doc. I have a bit of a memory issue. That's fine. You know that big book you've got. Mhm. Mm I want you to note down everyone who you ride with, 
Oh, horses they ride. Okay, yes. That book can't get into anyone else's hands, but it's something you should always remember and know. Okay. Oh, actually, I need to nip to that telegram station. I don't see him around. That might be his horse, though. Will you be able to be fast in the telegram station here? I have no idea. I'll come in with you and find out. Who are these people? No idea. Time. Miss Cabot right, time. Yes. T done. I, I wasn't saying you have to be done, I was saying how long you would take. Oh, right, yes. Well no, I'm I'm done. That was that was me done. Who was it? It was you. Alright, well. Then then I wanted to just I sent one to deck saying where are you? So it might be um, something in your throat. Oh, sorry, yes, no, it might be that um, I should maybe stay here. Just near the well, station. Well, you need to find your friends then. Hmm? You need to find your friends then. Well, they were heading back to the manor, so they said that's what their plan was to do, come and check their telegrams and go back to the manor. We didn't see them on the way out here, they might still be here. Alright, well maybe I should grab a gold pan whilst I'm here. Oh, uh, you could. Be the general store. Do we check for them in the polar house? It looks mm -hmm. quite busy. There they are. There they are. All three of them. We're going to have that conversation with Dex now. Uh, no, Dex. maybe we should do it. No, maybe we should do it in a few days. When, when we're both together and everyone's calmer. If, if things are going to be like this, it's not going to be able to wait a few days. No, no, it'll be fine. He's uh, not coming back. Is everything okay? Yeah. I'm just going to have to go to bed. Oh, well, here's your stew. Oh, thank you. He's changed again. Oh. Cap, oh, no, if you want to stew, um, Myrtle's got one for you. Oh, All of these horses. Yes. Stew, if you want. Oh, yeah, what's up? You alright, Doc? Oh, thank you. Okay. Yeah, we, we just yeah. came over here to grab some stew for people. I'm, uh, I'm heading to bed. Uh, My hero. Alright. Sure. I was just having a few drinks at the uh, saloon here. Where'd Cap go? Mm -hmm. uh, He's uh, inside? going inside to get his own stew, even though I told him. I bought him, him goddamn. I, I told him, I told him. He's a he muppet. Like Do you know what? I think it's because he doesn't quite understand when we say speak to us. Wait, what, what are you? Oh. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah. Oh god, maybe I should get my Mustang so you can try it out. Who, me? Well, we're here. Um, no, Cap. Because he was thinking about one, but apparently um, some people advised him not to. Or something like that. I don't know. I think they're good horses. So yeah. too. Although, I, to be fair, I think all the horses are good horses. I, uh, yeah. I, I think people tried to dissuade him from the Mustang because it wasn't as fast. But I need to trade off as they trade off as they run forever. Oh well, exactly. But it's still going to be better than the Morgan. Oh yeah, it is. They're still talking about. No, oh, and they're still so going just, on about. Okay. Just bought mm -hmm. one because. Uh, you know they sell one sausage for two dollars. I mean, hey, people sell peach cobbler for eight. Really? Mm hmm. Yeah, there's, there's a bakery up in Colts that's definitely underpricing themselves. Then. Yeah, it's like five to eight usually for a peach cobbler, depending on where you go. 
I tend to hand it out for free whenever I make a bunch. Right. I mean, well, I mean, it, I, we would pay people for stuff like that, but... <laughs> no, can't get in, Next though. time I find myself with nothing to do, I'll happily make a crate full of peach cobbler and drop it off. That conversation is making me lose my brain uh -huh. cells. Yeah, it, it will, <laughs> it'll, it'll continue. Oh. You know... There's one thing that so fucking down. bugs me about roads is black pants and roads just don't are, go are well sure together. Are you sure that uh, everything's okay, CC? Do you need oh, to step away? Mm, oh, no, it's fine. It's, yes, no. No, it's fine. I'll, I'm getting mixed signals into... here. Yes, no, right. yes, no, yes, no, it's fine. Just, no. Hang on. Oh, two of you over here right now. Please. So that was really, that was really cool yes, for you. I'm so sorry. Yes, I'm so ma'am. sorry. Oh, you're good. I'm just, uh... I... He, I may have insulted him. Making our like, sidebar uh, even more sided. I know, let's get really sidey. I, I kept calling him Chucky by accident during a conversation oh, of which I couldn't remember no. something he'd said to me. C -C. So I didn't do it on purpose. Oh, we had just no. been talking about Chucky. It's There is so much information I'm trying to hold in my head right now. Well then have somebody and else hold some. <laughs> no, yes, well, yes. Thing is, it's, yes, it's no, fine. I signals. say no. I just, uh, I quit. I don't. I do the secretary at this point. I do. It's my wife. Uh huh. Mm. Well, there She's you go. my. Actually, I was thinking of calling you the night manager. The, <laughs> okay. the night manager. Why do oh, I yes, be because we're on. Well, you know, it's not actually at night, but you know, the person that does the stuff that I do when I'm not there. Ah, yes. <laughs> Well, you I think just, there's you a better word for that, but we'll, we'll figure become, it out. Become it's like called, me and just... It's called wife. Like a sleep. Which, by the way, we oh. both have to get ourselves pretty, pretty posh people dresses. Oh, God. Oh, 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 why? I, I don't to be wear the dresses, ladies of the manor. I don't, I don't wear dresses. No, I don't, I really don't blame you. It's fine. You don't have to. I was... I will wear God, some I will like puffy. Dress. No, no. I, I will wear some puffy pants. That's it's about it. That's <laughs> as good as it gets. But yes, no. I I kept calling him Chucky. Oh God, <laughs> it's that's, such that's, a that's mistake. real bad. That's that's real bad. Well, no, do you know what? It makes it worse. He was talking to me about his feelings and about something he said to me the other day, apparently, which I don't remember. So now I don't know if it's a figment of my imagination or a figment of his imagination, or if I'm just losing the plot completely. Uh -huh. I'm talking to you about his feelings. Is this is this you know a, a continuation of the fact that you all you both went beat red? Right. The... <clears throat> Dex, not Dex. Mm -hmm. Now see, now I'm getting your name wrong. Declan. Oh my mm -hmm. oh, fuck! My. Names completely. I hate them. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> oh. You're doing so well, CC. I'm doing you know, terribly. There's a lot of times where names really matter, do and know, just make sure you don't mess it up then. Do right? No, do you know what? I'm suddenly feeling so terrible for the amount of grief I used to give Jack Kettleman for never remembering anyone's names. There is certain things in life uh, that, you know, you have to say the name correctly. <laughs> just don't fuck that up, okay? Okay. That's, that's real important. You might fucking mm -hmm. die. Like, if you start saying Chucky in a certain kind of something, you <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my goodness. I, I just too. <laughs> I bet you would <laughs> God oh, no, no. Just, I uh, this uh, Dex is sweet. He's lovely. Uh -huh. He's also mm -hmm. in a lot of danger if he decides that he likes me like that that's what you're concerned about i mean i feel CC, like he's already the side danger already right we had this conversation the other day i don't want to cause him any hurt either i get it but cc we're all in this together we are all in this together okay well um you know that's kind you of how that I... works you know being it's with you does not make it any worse because you're really no, no, no. with me so it's fine. right that's true i'm with you that's fine no but no also it's just, i can't he he he, he can't yeah, it needs to not be He's too well, impulsive and too in his feelings. Is it you don't like him or you don't, Susie. No, what? It doesn't matter if I like him or not. It's not. This isn't something that's happening right now. So you what, are you just waiting for it to happen? No, this is something that's not going. No, is it? <laughs> you see how it's confusing, right? Yes, I do. Yes. You know, Declan not... used to like me. Yep. Did he? That's delightful. Uh -huh. Declan's a sane human being. What? <laughs> 
Shit. Declan doesn't have a weird, creepy swamp witch running around, cutting her hand and wiping blood on him. And uh, trying to replace his teeth with alligator teeth. Exactly. I don't but know what is happening away, with that she? mess. I don't. She's just. Well, I was keeping her as our pet swamp witch, but someone told me we're not allowed to keep swamp witches as pets. Uh. <clears throat> what? I just be careful. Just, just don't, don't, don't divulge their information or of any sorts around her in regards to things. Just because Dex is going to mm. piss her off one day, and that's going to bite us in the bum. No, it's I gonna. Can, he's probably gonna die. Yes, can tell 100%. you I've seen the lady run around with. At my hands. Other times a day. Oh Easily. yeah, she spends time with the. She, she went on a date with Hobo Joe. Mm -hmm. She spends time with the hobos. Hmm. Yeah, she did two days ago. That's when I met her. This guy. Uh, just got very quiet real quick. Hello? Huh? Yeah. If we both stopped to <laughs> did you be thinking the same thing as me? If we both just kept quiet, yes. I could think that he'd gone deaf. This is shit. <laughs> I know I'd gone deaf. That's the thing. Yeah, but then I didn't want it to go on for too long, so <laughs> Both pieces of shit. No. Mm you should notice, Myrtle, the moment I call someone a little a little shit is when I care for them. Why do people say my name that way? What? Myrtle? Myrtle? I, it's, it's, I'm... F He's from Scotland? I mean, I know, but so many people do it, and then that's mm. when people start calling me turtle, and then it turns into a whole thing, and then I stab <laughs> him in the leg. Right, well, what should, what should, so we, should, should we say? Myrtle? Myrtle. <laughs> Myrtle. 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 Mur Myrtle. It, it, mm, it doesn't feel right. So the thing is, he's Scottish. He also says dirty and girl. Mm -hmm. And you can put both those words together and it's dirty yes. girl. And was I, your example, I, dirty girl? That was your was. Do you know what? Was. That is, that's, mm -hmm. Do you know what? Go on, say it. Say, say those two words together, Declan. Why? It's just something about the Scottish accent when it says it. Go on, say it. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm alright. Right. I'm alright. Do, 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 right. do it, it proper with right. the, the little Scottish doodle at the end of it. Oh, yeah. oh. Now oh. I feel like I've been put on the spot. You definitely are. So they're yes. walking do back, so I'm not going Hello. to. Hello. No, 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 your time. Your time. Why do you want to be called a dirty girl? See, it just sounds so nice. Right? Let's see. I mean, do you want me to replace the first word with good? No! No, because it doesn't sound the same, does it? It's just, just the way it, the, the, it's pronounced. <laughs> I think she did want me to do it. Oh, right. Well, there That's you go. why she's walking away right now. Me and the wife clearly have very similar. Um, <clears throat> anyway. Mm -hmm. Hello, Captain. Still gone. Oh, sure, no. How is my alcoholic bodyguard? Is he still being an alcoholic? <sighs> I mean, he's getting another drink for me and him. No. Right, we'll keep an eye on him because he does have issues with alcohol. Don't worry, I am trying my best. For some reason, I have a soft spot for this kid. Maybe because he reminds me of myself. In my well, younger that's days, encouraging, of isn't it? In my younger days, of course. I have grown up since then. Yeah, I've got you number one. Yeah. Fuck me. Yeah. Oh. Um... A few, a few. I used to fellow in there. Some, some woman as well talking to me about something. I don't know. Fuck knows what she's saying. Here, take this. Don't be me and you, we can have a few of them today, ain't we, Captain? Me and you. Fuck no, who cares? Four, five, six, seven, eight, I don't know. Yeah, there you go. I'm about to tie this motherfucker up and throw him in the water. Like fucking high numbers, just make sure you can sit in a horse though. I gave you, I gave you. Trying to give you the beer. Is... Hmm. No, yeah, I ain't. 
No, it's all right, CC. Declan, how you doing? You all right? I didn't think you'd come down here. It's front of man. I didn't know you was here. I saw the dark. He said he's going to sleep. So he's going to go get some rest. Hmm. You all right, Dex? He's all right. I'm fine, Mr. Whoever you are. I don't even know who you are. His no, name I'm is Declan. <laughs> <laughs> me. Fuck me. He's got fucking issues. Yes. I want hello, hello, hello. By the way, hello, hello. Yeah, it's got a bit of a temper, doesn't he? I think he just has demons. Yeah, I mean, that's clear as day, but sometimes you gotta fucking work past that, because let's be real, everybody's got demons. Yes, that's very true. I feel like it's uh, something you can't fucking avoid. Yep. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Just, just the way it goes. You know, if you don't have demons, you haven't fucking lived life. Right. Sad as that might be to say, but you know, I feel like it's true. Uh, yes. Hi, Chad, baby doll. It's your baby doll. Is that Faye? I think it is Faye. Definitely looks like Faye. Riding with... Uh, that is a question. Two people I don't think I know, not at first glance at least. Then again, there's so many fucking faces and names to remember, it's insane. No, we didn't get to see Alice and we'll, just, we'll wait and see if we get a telegram from her, but I don't think she's interested in the information anymore. Are you okay, Cece? Me? Yes. Mm -hmm. You sure? Much better. You supply us with wood on a regular basis. <laughs> I might be able to. <laughs> I mean, we'd pay you. Mm -hmm. Gives yeah, you a good reason to come and go from the manor. Oh, this is true. He's gonna walk back to the manor. On his own? Oh, for fuck's sake. Ugh. Don't worry, I'm gonna trail him. Right, well, I'm gonna go right, grab some bits out of my storage. There, I know he, right, there's bloody panthers in that woods. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to trail him to make sure he's all right. But yeah. I'm going to let him walk back alone. Why does he need to be alone? actually told me I should hunt those panthers. Why does he need to be alone? Mm. So he can understand that no one's going to go chasing after him because he's feeling sorry for himself. I'm only going to follow him to make sure he doesn't fucking die. Fucking hell, he's, he's, he's bound to fucking start calling you Papa Cap at this point. You better fucking know. <laughs> You're teaching him life lessons, though. Someone's gotta do it. Mm. Start fucking tailing him, make sure he's alright. Mm. Right, okay. This goes against my every fiber of my being not to go after him and be like, are you okay? Yeah, but I feel like Cap's right, though. He is right. He needs to know that no one's going after him when he does this. Mm -hmm. He needs to learn to but use you his wanna words do it because like a you big like him. boy. No, I don't. I'd do it for anyone. Mm -hmm. I'd do it because I'm I a know, mug. I know, you also like him. No, well, I like everyone. Mm-hmm. But I do! I just- I like everyone! I care about everyone! You're the one that went all flush in the face, though. What? The, the, shut up. Uh-huh. What's been happening? Why are people talking? Oh! Nothing so wrong with Dex- that. Dex brought up the conversation from outside Valentine's Saloon where he was like, you complete me. And Cecily doesn't remember <laughs> it because Cecily's brain has gone, nope. And just refuses to recall stuff like that oh, because see, see. to her it feels like manipulation. I know. Welcome back. Hmm? 
And then I, I kept accidentally calling him Chucky. You shouldn't be saying. Me? Huh? Oh. For him? What do you think you were in, saying? In fairness, I was asked to say those words. To me, it okay, feels like yeah. manipulation. Yeah. And the thing is, Cecily doesn't respond <laughs> okay. to manipulation that yeah, she fine. senses very well. Mm. And her brain will do things to like protect her from it. And in this instance, uh, it's just where is everybody else? It. Uh, Dex is walking back to the manor because he's shit-faced wankered um, and the cab is actually following him at a safe distance because he would like Dex to realise that no one is going to go running after him when he's feeling sorry for himself. And the only reason he's going is to make sure he doesn't Vivian get by a cougar. Oh, hi, Vivian. Oh, hello. Oh, pardon me, sorry for the interruption. <laughs> I'll just apologize for interrupting anything. Oh, well, well, trees. It was good. Um, you get what you needed. To... Oh yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, Ryan and Boom, Thomas, her. Mary and JJ. So, mm. 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 and two crows of old people. <laughs> Doesn't surprise me. So uh, that was nice. They uh, mm. were headed out the way up, so I figured I'd just head this way since I have to go to St. Denis. Oh, well, good luck. Mm hmm. What the hell are you doing in St. Denis? Um, playing. Oh, God. oh is it Poker Night? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, it is. And my mouth, may have, gotten me... my mouth may have gotten me into a little bit of trouble, so hopefully mm -hmm. everything will go all right. What'd you do? Um, I may have mentioned that there was game to Thomas, and I thought I was whispering, but I was in the telegram office, and it wasn't, and somebody overheard, and, well, hopefully it won't oh. be any trouble. Wait, who overheard? I feel um, like the main question here. But, um, an associate of a particular group of folks that... Uh -huh. You know, enjoy robbing things, so... You know, there's a lot of groups of folks that do that. No, I'm really interested. Well, I'm trying to be discreet. You know, I, I don't just, think I, it's working. I, I think you should just be playing. I can't, mm -hmm. I can't be, like, a true gossip, you know? Mm -hmm. It's not true gossip. It's also uh, figuring out, you know, if you're hurt, who did it. Um... Yeah, depending on who it was and what group, things could be very different. Can you different. give me the first letter? Um... Well, I actually don't know who they're associated with, but somebody was saying that they're associated with some group of people, but I don't know. Okay, what Ro region? Rody was dating, so, uh, but I don't know if he heard me. So, yeah, that group of people, in other words, all right. Well, it could be multiple, because the fellow who was asking me about it is associated with somebody else, I think, but I have no idea. Anyway, so I'm having to deal with it. Well, um, if they did overhear, what is exactly they overheard? Oh, um, just that there's a, a tournament game. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, high buy you know. They will definitely be stopping by, and I don't mean to play cards. Mm hmm So, um, yeah, well. Mm. Who's running security this time? Uh, nobody. <laughs> Wait, I thought all the fucking tournament games had security. They did. Right, I will be right back. Sorry. Come on. Mm -hmm. Okay. They uh, did, but Bluestone is. Uh... Oh, lots of people. Chucky. Problem is, guys, Cecily really does care about. Uh, not Chucky, Dex. Fuck me, I can't get names right today. But the issue is, Cecily does really care about Dex. Like, she has. There's like a soft spot there for him, but he's just pushing for too much too quickly from her. More than she's willing to give as well, under the circumstances, because she can't give it.
we don't get robbed. We go find some at the mana for it. Yeah. And it's just she's not she's not prepared for this sort of stuff anymore. Like she doesn't she, she's she's scared of all this sort of stuff. Especially as this sort of stuff she she kind of has to walk a very lonely path now. Well I tried. It's not the first that he won't be. Yeah, right. It baffles you, does it? Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out if any of these are actually uh, Dexes. I keep calling him Chucky today. This is today is not a good day for me and names. No, it's <laughs> not. not. Jeez, the weeds. Okay. Just wait for your own well-being. Maybe you just start giving everyone nicknames. It might help. Right. Well, maybe. But yes, yeah, so I'm trying to work out which one of these is Dexters. I'm gonna just call him Dexter. Dexter's horse. Okay, do, do you know what it looks like? No, I can't believe you remember a thing. <laughs> right, I guess I'm walking back to the manor. Well, I can take you. I have a horse. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you do have a horse. I didn't want to make you two leave your, you know, things we're behind. We're not really like... doing much here. We we're just still here because oh, y'all are here. Yeah, we oh. came here for the stew for you guys, remember? Oh, what have I got caught up on? No! Oh no! No, it's my headset. <laughs> no, we have a fucking CC. CC? Wait, what? Oh my god. We came here for this stew for you guys. Oh, right, That's yes. That's the only reason we were here. Uh, okay, okay, let's get going. Yeah, I feel like. I, I, I am. Um, no, my. Maybe. I don't know anymore. Maybe, guys. This is gonna be maybe a short stream. Cause come, come. I'm fucking up. Come, come. Up, up. Darling, up, up. Come, come. Where did he just go? Oh, there he is. So, is this all because you called him the wrong name? He's just real upset. Uh, no, I think it's because I don't remember something that he told me in Valentine. Like I, I generally, I don't, I don't remember it. Oh. Well, just tell me, having quite a day. Quite a day. Well, yes. I mean, I suppose it doesn't help that the doc keeps getting involved as well, and I suppose he needs to because uh, it's just it's just a difficult thing. It's, 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 it's a very sensitive thing that needs to be navigated, and I'm confident we can come through this in the right place, eventually. Oh yeah, I hope so. I don't know any other way to go. No, I hope so. Otherwise, me and you have to murder him. Oh! Yeah. Woo! Oh. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Declan! I that was, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I had that mm, puckered up. Let's put it that way. Did you, was that a little bit, bit white-knuckled there? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Squeaky bum moment. Yeah, just a little bit. <sighs> so what exactly would we have to kill him for? Is there like something more that I should know or something? Huh? Oh no, it's only because I made a threat to him that if he does anything to jeopardize what we're building, I will put him down. Oh well, yeah, I, that's I, 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 I quite like to go through. I like to follow through with my threats. No, I get it. I I'll help you with that. I really hope we just doesn't come to that. Oh, I hope so too. For anybody here, really. You know, I do love how close this place is to roads, but it's so closed off, like, in the same town. Of all the trees. I still think that you should... We, we need to... Uh, that's... But why am I doing this? My plans today. I need to right. I need to sober the silly boy up. If he's even here. Uh, he's even here. And give him a task. There's so many things I need being done. Manner. What well, that is? Coyotes. Mm-hmm. 
Huh. Not a single horse. I think he could have lost him on his walk. We're not going out and searching for them in the dark. They, was, they can bloody well learn their lessons. Oh shit, no, to be fair. Oh. Hang on. Well, maybe we lost them on the walk? I don't... Oh, I fucking... What? What? What is this? What what is this that we're dealing with right now? What what why why is this? Uh, wait, why? Hold on. So let, let, me, why? let me get this straight. So Dexter got upset with something that you forgot about, and you also called him the wrong name. Yes. And then he got drunk and walked away, and now Cap is out there following behind him mm -hmm. on a horse, mm -hmm. and now we have no idea where either of them are. Yep. We can't be doing this. Nope. Because if something were to happen where we needed help, we, we can't mm -hmm. be having this at all. No, I know. Like, shit's gonna get real, real, real time soon, and we can't just be having whatever this is supposed to be. Like I said, this is very much a dangerous situation. Huh. Where, where'd the doc go? The doc's gone to bed. Oh, the doc went to Ah, yes, so... You know what's really refreshing, though? What? It's the two ladies that are the ones with the level heads right now. <gasps> and Declan. And Declan. Well, De Declan oh, is our wood supplier. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, Just please don't say that to Jackie. what the wood I'm supplying <laughs> is. And that's, that's, you know... Quality. Mm. I mean, you know, of course it's going to be quality. Where do you think he would go? I bloody baffled you. I, I like, not a clue in the foggy is. I mean, he literally told Cap that he was going to walk back to the manor. Uh huh. And the like, fact the that they he's about as navigationally challenged as I am. Yeah, I just hope they didn't run into Panther. I love this place, and I feel like no one ever really spends much time here. Yeah, they really don't. Um, I mean, I'm worried about a panther. I'm worried about numerous things. Like, I, I, d I don't... <sighs> Alright, yes. This life that we're living is not exactly all, all butterflies and rainbows and nobody's gonna fuck with you. People will fuck Thank with you, you and they will put you down. And they don't give a shit who you are walking on the side of the road and they don't care how much you had to drink. And they don't give a shit about your petty little issues. Well, the problem is, I'm more worried that they will quite happily be, like, I, I'm not worried about Dex's safety so much as the people that he turns on safety. And then the fallout what, so from that. Danger? Dex is quite the dangerous young man, yes. I don't know why I call him a young man, he's older than me. But still, Dex, Dex can be quite the dangerous individual. That, that is very comforting, CC. So all, all of them can be. <laughs> I mean, all people can be, but the way that you're saying it right now is that he's unstable. Well, that's, he's that's... pissed as a fart. Yes, I think he might be unstable. Well, uh, we could just hope got... that Cap did follow him all the way to where they're supposed to be. Does she have... Yeah, she's not on Twitch. Maybe they went into the city, which would not be a good it's idea. Genix. She's, uh, I don't know who else she plays. Other than the city is not far from here. Oh, that's possible. Oh, that's a lot of fucking... That's a lot of people. Mm -hmm. We're just gonna go this way. Oh, actually, we can... That might... Can we actually head back to the manor? Because I just realised I've got... My mind of done on me. And that looks like that might be the cab. I mean, we're close. I think it's in here. I think. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, no, I was just emptying out my storage to move it to the actual manor. Oh, oh. hello. Oh, God. Where is he? Where's your young lad? 
Here are. I was tailing him. You walk uh, behind a tree uh, and then poof, gone. Jesus. Like a ghost. He walked behind one single tree and then was gone. I walked up to the tree. He wasn't there. Christ alive, where is this freaking guy? Okay. Well, mm -hmm. one down. <laughs> Oh, don't ask are we me are we are we going with the let nature take its course uh, approach again? Honestly, he could probably learn the lesson. Uh, okay. Uh, but, like I said, I was tailing him real well. He walked behind a tree and didn't walk out from behind it. I'd also like to mention if the law catches him, that's gonna be a bad thing. I went to the house twice, he didn't somehow sneak away from me. Um, so... Did he knew that you were trailing No. No. He was walking along the fence of, um... The Caliga. Uh -huh. I was in the trees. Yes, he is falling. He should remember for at least the next few days our high peach, huh, baby doll? No, I don't know if you decided to walk behind the tree and fell asleep and I just missed him in the bush or... Uh, I went behind the tree and he wasn't there. Huh. I walked the road a couple of times, couldn't see him. Even checked in the fields in Gallagher, couldn't see him in there either. He literally just vanished. Well, he does move like the bloody night. He is a swamp person now. If he gets caught by the law, it's going to be real bad. Mm -hmm. We're going to have to spend the rest of the bloody day looking for him, aren't we? Uh, at least today, yeah. Yep. Let me just go into the house first and um, sure, load yeah, what's yeah. in my pockets. Nah, I don't go looking for him. Just gonna put some stuff away. Um, then we're gonna go look at it. Where would we like to? We're gonna put it in our bedroom. Yeah. We're gonna use some storage in the fancy bedroom. If we can. Is there anything in here that can be used for fancy storage? Can you like use? It'd be amazing if you could use the wardrobe. Nope. Okay, let's think. Maybe at the bottom of the bed. Oh, Jesus! Let's stop riding around five hundred dollars on us. Get out of here, you. For now, that'll do. Oh. Hmm. I can come out of my my back now. Buongiorno. Try not to hit Myrtle, my guy. Come, come. Oh. Why, yes, darling. Come, come. Come, come. Mm -hmm. Come, come. Um... Alright, so we should probably check the city next. Mm -hmm. I don't think he's come to see. Well, I thought he'd come here and he's not here, so we uh, don't really have much choices right now. Let's chill back to the bush that Cap lost him in. Where was yeah, that, okay, do you know? I can show you where I lost him. Yeah, go ahead.
thing. Sorry. Fish me this one here. You walked behind it and didn't walk out from behind it. This tree here? And then this tree right in front of me. Walk behind it, didn't walk out from behind it. He didn't jump the fence because if he'd jumping into clear grass, would have been able to see him. down the street because I literally walked straight down the path. Right, I think maybe we can potentially assume that he maybe passed out for a moment and then got up and waddled off. I've walked up and down this path about three times. Did you go all the way to the city? Let's check the town, maybe he went back mm -hmm. to us. Yeah, because I was following them through these trees. Yeah. Turn left here. Run inside real quick and see. You better not be inside drinking. Oh, I've just had a telegram, but. Oh, sorry. Hey. Uh, hey. Hello. Uh, has anyone seen a very drunk redhead? Yes. Oh, uh, no. no. Oh, can I say I have? No, the yes. When, when was that, if you don't mind me asking? Does he have, like, really baggy, dark circles under his eyes? Yes. And yeah, the quite the scar in his face. Like, oh, second, he right? ordered four well, beers and then left. Yeah. Right. I don't suppose you mentioned where he was heading off to, did he? No, I just saw him leave out the front about 30 minutes ago, and I ain't seen him since. Ah, uh, right. Okay. Uh, thank you. He's with a group of folk, though, I think. Mm, well, the thing is, I found the group of folk, but none of us have found him, so... Oh, all right. Well, hopefully he's all right. Well, uh, yeah, yes, yes. Uh -huh. right. yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> all right, thank you for that. Yeah, no problem. Good luck. Appreciated. Can we just nip around to the uh, telegram? Yeah, of course. Yeah, I got a telegram. Yeah, did see Indy down there. Down. At the uh, Rose Telegram office. Oh, Sounds good. like you logged off. No, I didn't. You oh. did. If it isn't Cuckoo Cowdwell, so thank you, Blaina. This guy, he knows what it's like. Yeah, it probably is the telegram. It's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, it's a pleasure sake. meeting you too. Joy. Indies with the snitch. Hi, Canary. Well, I can't right now. A wild duckling has appeared. Well, <laughs> go around, I'll be down in Thebes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's just like oh, really cheerful. Cheerful people are out here. Oh, everybody. Oh, hi. 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 Oh, here, Rev. Oh, hello. Good morning. We are not, we are not lining up. Your beautiful black eye. I read. Do you remember the reason? The reason I had to disappear the other day. Oh. Uh, yeah. All right. I now actually might be able to finish up for that reason. Are you alright to keep looking for? Oh fuck! That's what's been chucking again. Dex for me. 
Oh, uh, yeah, I will do that, yeah. And then I will rendezvous with you as soon as possible. That's not a problem. You telegram me, okay? I will telegram you straight away. Your hair is kind of darkening the first time in the States. It's kind of turning brown. You're American, guys. I need to go get my horse. This is West, yeah, this is West. Why are you tense about the meeting? Alice freaks you out? Why? I'm too tired for this. This is terrible, but it's fine.
that's too deep there. Yeah, I do as well. I'm gonna I'm gonna nip through Blackwater and send a telegram to her. Cecily is very dangerously as well, with taking herself closest to the West she's been in a while on her own. I also really need hasn't told anyone where she's actually going. When did she send that, by the way? Because we've been looking for this. Fuck, it's 20 minutes ago. but she also speaks really quietly so we're going to turn this down a little bit so we can hear her when we see her if we see her I also want to make sure I've got my notes up for this because I can't remember any from yesterday so This might end up being a really long conversation. So what we're going to do is we're going to have to fake this real quick, so I can nip to the bathroom because I'm not I'm not dealing with needing to pee whilst we're doing this. I get nervous enough when we see Alice. I don't need to need to nervous we at the same time. Thank <laughs> you. 
just gonna do this, and then we're gonna do this. And I'll be right back really quickly. No, we're not gonna do that because that was weird. No, it's fine. It'll do. I'll be right back. We are back. Okay. Oof. Come on, horse. Let's throw this round here. to drop. No, not really. What do you mean the moment of truth? What do you mean? Oh, actually, whether or not she's here or not. Hopefully. Is it depends on where she would sit. Man, baby, don't you give me like you give me so much anxiety sometimes. You really are the devil in Cecily's brain. I should have put the sunglasses on. No, no sunglasses needed. All right, well if she is here, thing is now I'm gonna go looking around for her. And it's gonna look like I'm snooping. Gosh 
gosh darn it. I mean, if we waited in Thieves, sure, but do you know who else we see when we wait in Thieves? People we don't want to see, so. We do know that they sometimes go around the back of here, so. Hear someone else's horse. Could that be Alice? I don't know who that is. I'm like around the back of here. Oh no, it's around the back of that bit. I don't know where the bloody hell I'm going. She just rode through. Oh, splash. In case. No. Fuck. Random rock. I'm not going to try and chase her down. I'm however gonna brush my horse. We'll wait for a minute. Maybe she went to the loo too and straight to the telegram, quite possibly. Let's be honest, we all need to pee. We are all human and we all need to pee. And I've drank so much cups of no horse, I wanted to leave you here. Thing is, I don't want to look like I'm a thieves local, so I don't want to go get comfortable and sit down. <laughs> Because I don't want to be like, she's turning up and throwing her weight around. So I guess we're just going to wait here. Fine. We're just going to walk. How much money have I got on me? $50. No point buying the things that I was going to buy then. Oh, I could go and collect eggs. No, why am I talking about eggs? No one's gonna fuck with someone that's waiting for Alice. Outlaw therapy. I hate him. I hate him so much. Um, actually, I wanna read the newspaper. Let's see what's in there. Rockwell's treasures. No. Prioritising safety crackdown on speeding. An uptick in accidental returns led deputies more strictly enforcing the rules. Animals are not penned or hitched. Okay, missing five. Wait, is, is five still missing? That got loud. What happened? Did I get really loud? Did I start shouting? Doors department and the department. Nope. Well of terror. Wendy Wells. Fitz got his job! Oh, I need to send him a telegram and congratulate him. Oh, the music just got really loud. Sorry. Mm. Anyway, we're coming from a syringe. Last time with blonde hair, braided green with white up. Feels much shit. No! Serious unfortunate events. Are you laying on the northern bottle? Okay. You can lead a fell into water. During the transfer of the Pickering brothers escape. There's a bunch of new brothers. Oh, Jack and That Ronnie is in Sills Ronnie. Cool, cool, cool. Western Barbarians warning. Oh. While checking on the taxes at McFarlane, Kelly and Rude Boy had some things to say. Of course they bloody did. Of course they did.
going to learn how to bear the competition. A new type of healing. Oh. Ah, Dr. Ovid and Sissica. Red Lion, Gems and Jewelry. Beast at Large. Okay. Mama me, Mia, me some fine meats. Wow. Do you seek the spotlight? Do you shine on stage? Acclaimed performer Sir Dickie White is seeking actors for his forthcoming play. Depends on needles a moment to ponder. He wants poetry. Oh. Oh. Hiya! Before I even realized it was you. Oh, right, yes, I might have been wandering around the back. Would you mind uh, just coming with us? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Is everything okay? No, everything's I'm just on my way to meet somebody. Ah, right, okay. I just read the newspaper and saw that Fiber was missing. Is, is everyone okay? Fiber is fine. Okay. You seem to have a couple of bees flying around your head, huh? Ah, okay, I will. Mm -hmm. Is it really bad? Maybe. Let's see if we can fix that. Why do I always get problems with this? It's always when I see one of the KG as well, it's like my mic shits the bed. The last time you saw my husband. Can you even remember? The last time I saw Mills. Mm-hmm. Uh, no. Jeez, it was a long time ago. I've had telegrams from him since, but never had a chance to actually catch him. Gotcha. Think. No, I generally can't remember. Last time I saw him was when I turned up with the fireworks. Jesus. I know, I think, anyway. Unless, of course, he's come by in passing and I've just, it's like a, an extra person. I don't think so. Gosh, it's such a long time ago. Time goes by differently on the outside than it does on Sissica Island. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think it's, it's, it's been quite, quite the long while for all of you. Is he okay? Yeah, he's fine. No! Head pop! Oh. I might not get back in. No, this is odd that she's taking me to meet someone, but I do not. I trust Alice. I trust Alice. It's probably to go see Mills. Probably.
Man, head pop's the worst thing. Oh, wow. Fuck. Oh, there we are. What, did we all pop? I think we might have all had a bit of a headache there. That is Alice's horse, isn't it? I'm going to hop onto there. Is that Alice's horse? It might not be Alice. About. There's loads of fox about, thank you very much. Why have you stopped to see me, please? Oh! That's her horse, yeah. I'm sorry I'm just trying to figure out if we've actually met before and I'm just staring at you instead which is really quite rude yeah that's uh sorry I don't normally talk much oh it's quite why not I figured if I have a lot of things to say, you know, I'd say some. Mm. Oh, right. Ain't nothing personal. Um, no, no, I that's absolutely start with fine. Introductory. Uh, name is Marietta. Uh, if you're fancy, Murray for short. Short, sweet, to the point. Ah, right. I yeah. think we might have met once before, near Christmas time. You were very intoxicated. Uh, it's not normally. Oh, I think no, actually. The, uh, I think you were the sober one that night, actually. Perhaps. What was your name? Uh, Cecily Caldwell. Huh. It might be New Year's, actually. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, it can't have been New Year's. I remember my New Year's. Uh, <laughs> I was serving it in Sisica. Oh. I'm terribly sorry I've had that place is absolutely awful. Mm. Oh! <laughs> That's Marietta. I love what Alice wears. She always looks so good. And a little bit savage. I was like, we're we waiting for it. It's the ranger, isn't it? Okay. Have you guys seen anyone injured out here? Mm, no. Uh, what's it say? Sorry? What's it say? It says a big valley. Central big valley. Alright, uh, can we go? I'm about to fucking. Off somewhere checking around the strawberry area. That's still technically Central Big yeah. Valley. Mm. If I have one more fun problem, I might actually scream and throw everything I have on me. Oh god. <laughs> so, so just be prepared for that. Try and save that energy for later. Am I? No. Being pulled into something? Yeah, I think I know better than to tell you what to do. Only if but it happens again. Just trying to make it a doctor's order, rather. 
doctor's order. Pfft. Order smarty. My mind is racing. I'm trying to figure. I'm, I've got the biggest grin on my face right now. Cold the up. biggest grin. This is too late for me to be on a Sunday, but I like big grin. Don't know why, because really, I think I should probably be scared. But so, Cecily, how was your trip? Ah, so I never actually made it across, but I did send some people up ahead of me, and they came back before I was expecting them with some. Uh, information. Alright. So it would turn out that Edgar is currently looking to have guns, gold and gems imported onto the island. Um, the other day he did try to hire my people to uh, transport him across the crossing, but then he changed his mind. But he seems to be building something up out there. Alright. Actually, it was something I really did want to talk to you about because I think I think uh, my the, my people I hate saying my people but I think my people may have inadvertently set it up some sort of trust with him for future trade opportunities. And I was wondering if that'd be of any use to you. At the moment, not necessarily, but maybe Mills has some ideas. Probably not, though. Yeah, it's a bit, place? it's a bit odd and tricky that we're sort of meeting at this point because last night James managed to get a uh, get himself arrested trying to get a hold of Edgar, who came back to the crossing. Ah, right. Yeah. He himself got arrested, and when James tried to get in and get him, he got. They all got shot down and... Uh, is James in for a long time? Not that I know of, no. I mean, as far as I know, I don't think he was wanted, and if he was, it wasn't for very long. Okay. But if there's something else that, uh, Mills will want to talk to you about. Oh, right, okay. Doing that for me though. Oh no, not a problem. Right, but every time I've said if I can help, I, I do mean it. I have had it pointed out to me recently that I always sound like I'm being insincere when I'm being sincere, but I, I do mean that I will always help. I know you, Cece. You don't have to worry about convincing me. No, I know. I think at this point I'm having to just do a hell of a convincing of a lot of things. up to for James. Ah, oh right. Mm -hmm. It's probably for the best then that my mind didn't help get him across the crossing the other day because they could have been yeah. up in a gunfight. Oh bloody hell. Well there you go, some things do happen for a reason. Jesus. Oh, 
Okay. Howdy. He's, he's with the Alice. All right. Who the it's hell me, is okay. that? It's one of these. Oh, hello. I figured we should talk to her about, you know, her prophecy. Sorry? Your prophecy. Did you send Am me a I... telegram about the West Fallen? No. Okay. So Al then... Alice, we're gonna be... We're, we're getting ready. We're gonna be scouting out the job. Okay. Right, so what... So you Am didn't... I allowed to inquire what this prophecy is? You never sent him a telegram. I mean, I've sent Mills telegrams about, you know, I mean, things like in the past. In the, in the past week. Uh, no. The last telegram I sent was about the auction and getting those guns back. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Well. You take Max. Wanna go to the- Are you sure? Yeah, I'm not just gonna leave here without a horse. We got shit to do. Right, okay. Um... Thanks for telling I me will... what I needed to know. Oh, right, no, you're very welcome. Uh, am I allowed to ask you for some more advice regarding that at a later time? Um... Yeah, later. Perfect, alright. Uh, have fun, stay safe, and if you need anything, just shout. I will. Take care. Oh, yes, you too! Oh, you too! Oh. Huh. What fucking prophecy, guys? What am I missing? What, what am I missing and why do people think I'm sending telegrams? What? Like, sorry, so you understand... No, I don't! I'm so confused! I want to ask them. I kind of want to get really aggressive and ask them because I'm kind of sick of people... Like, I'm really sick of people just assuming Cecily has done something. I'm, I'm really appreciative to them, which is why I think I didn't have Cecily get angry because Mills and Alice have always reached out and gone, hey, what's happened? They've always asked her rather than assume things but the, that's such a baffling thing to, i didn't even expect to be asked something like that i was if i was going to be asked something i thought it was going to be about the people coming across to cecily so what is this like is there a cult what's the prophecy about I kind of want to just keep riding around on Alice's horse, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop it into the stable here and swap to my horse. You understand? I don't fucking understand. I want to know what rumours are happening now. Horse. What is it? An Arabian. Oh, that's why it's a nice horse. I had an Arabian, Alice, and then I gave it to my brother because I'm a dumbass. Why not? I can't decide if we're angry or not, guys, or if we're just fed up. Honestly, the biggest load of bullshit ever. If you ever get the meta, you'll be in tears. I don't want the meta. I don't want the meta. I just never want to find out what this bullshit is, because I... You... Man, a prophecy? Okay. Alice's horse is beautiful, but I don't need to ride it around. I need to know what that's all about. I was terrified to suggest that she was going to get killed over this absolute nonsense that you don't know. 
No, was it not bad? I thought you were just being a cretin because of what was happening in Guama. Why would Cecily get killed for it though? I don't understand this. Oh shit, India, I forgot to, and then I ran off. Okay. I wanted to let Ruth know. You fucker. <laughs> Left your horse with the stables. It was good seeing you. I uh, don't know. Left with the stables. Mm. Be around tomorrow. But for a act. On the something. I'm alright, something I would really love some advice from yourself. Even Mills, if he is willing to give it. I, it, uh, we want advice on this because I don't want to like. We can uh, we can utilize the Edward uh, the Edgar thing, but I don't want to associate with Edgar for the longer than we have to. But if it could be useful to them in the future, then that's great. If not, I don't I don't want anything to do with it, and I'm going to tell my men to be like, nope, we're not dealing with him. He is the sort of person that will fuck over what we're trying to do. They safe. And please do tell me about the prophecy. They say. We're around tomorrow, but I've got before I act I would really love some advice from myself. Even though Susan to give it. I need more info on that prophecy. Someone is signing my name on telegrams. Man, I hope not. And I hope that's I hope Cecily will not find that out. I'm gonna sit here. Now there's actually whilst I'm here, I'm gonna send the telegrams that I wanted to send to people that I keep saying I wanna send and I keep forgetting. What have we heard over the last few days that I need to talk contact people about? What have I said and just forgotten because there's too much bullshit going into my brain? I wish they'd let us see the telegram before they run off. They they they're clearly busy. This is the thing with them, they've always been busy. Man, I was getting low-key excited they were gonna bring me along for a job. 
low-key excited there. That was why I was grinning so much. Little did I know that apparently we're part of bullshit again. Right. Cecily's too busy to have any sense, or they're too busy. Okay. Who are we dealing with? I'm, this, this guy's dead now. Oh, them. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, he's dead. Oh my god, everyone's dead. In the... I need to, that's what I need to do. I need to deal with fucking Chucky. Have you seen... Not Chucky. His name's not even Chucky today. Jesus, Dex. He has gone missing. Cecily. That's one. Man, my heart. I'm so sad. Like, do I know anyone that I could ask about this? <gasps> Rodney! I need to send him a telegram one day. Lincoln Kinley. Kinley, I don't even Kinley's still alive. John. No, we're not we leave that we do that. <laughs> Rob me and I will end your lives. What do you make? And what are your misses? Let's see. Hey, I, eight, oh, eight, four, one. Hey, I, eight, four, one. Ah, thank you for that, Joy. I think I've got much in me, guys. Uh, like, it's gonna be bedtime soon, I think. Um, man, you know who would know? This guy. He'd know exactly what's happening. He knows everything for some bloody reason. I don't remember who this person is. I want to send a telegram. Hello, Elio. I am so sorry. It took me this long to telegram you. It's been a busy few days. I would. Still, really love to learn to fight, and I may have a few other people interested. We don't, but we're gonna make um, some of ours go and learn. Accessory. Oh wow, was this actually a thing last night? Jesus. Freaking hell. Cecily really what how? I don't understand how this girl gets it so hard. 
Man, I'm a, we're killing Cecily. We're just going to go play Andy. No, we're not. Where are you? I don't have long in me, but I want to hug before my before I go to sleep. Love, easy. We love Cece. I know you guys do. No, we're not. Cece's not going anywhere. Not now. We, what we're doing, if we do it right, could be so great. Who are these chumps? No, this is the dappers. Red tie. This is the dappet. Nah, she sucks. But they're muppets. Yeah, I know. Chat baby doll. I love you too. Come on, let's see what happens, fellas. Can I? Can a lady not just send telegrams about people just being everywhere? Who just Jesus Christ did? I know for a fact that's dappers. Red ties. Where's my horse? I don't even know what I've done with my horse. Howdy. Oh, hello. This is suddenly a very popular station today. <laughs> Over there. Wondering if I could possibly discuss discuss paying you. I to. Give. I think we should go to the saloon at Emerald and drink. No, they don't. <laughs> I was paying you to give some friends of mine medical training. Especially. Fucking outright there, AI841. They ain't making friends, it's just so curt. Uh, I'm still just waiting for a telegram from my guys. None. We're not telling Duck what's happened. He doesn't need to know the drama. Okay, Dustin. Oh, why keep calling Dustin? Dustin. It's been a while. Remember? He promised not to ignore me, or not to neglect. Uh, almost not to forget me this time. Also, do you have any uh, handcuffs? I could die. For reasons. I'm ignoring these people because I am busy sending a telegram. You're not getting in the way of my gogat like mammoth type of telegrams. Who's standing next to me? Are they just waiting? Oh, he's in black water. Man, this place? Why is there so many people? <laughs> Can't sleep. Bernie. Yeah. I won't. We're gonna go run away, I guess. 
Um, you did. Tomorrow? Okay. I hope you're around tomorrow. Please, can you ensure the following is accomplished in my absence? We need to acquire our own. Acquire. That's not how you spell acquire. Acquire. No, no stream tomorrow. Um, so Zom, who plays Marie, uh, Jack Stone is coming to visit. So tomorrow, I'm not gonna like ignore just a stream. So we're gonna go to cinema instead, and then I'll be back on on Tuesday night. Good. I'm busy. Yeah. Why can I not spell acquire? A U U I. It, that is how you spell acquire. Acquire handcuffs. Uh, a few sets of handcuffs. House stuff. Potential civilians. Potential trustworthy civilians looking for work. Yeah, so I didn't spell that quite right. It just looks weird for the capital. Okay, your face. Oh, we need more things. What things do we need done? Um, have Costas. Watch for the trains and make notes of time and of any high value trains and the times they are traveling. <laughs> Regards. Regards. Let's see. Wait for one. Also, and that's a dog. Oh. Isn't that where she is? I'll say by the the way, the same sort of thing that happened today used to happen to certain other characters a bunch. Eventually it got too much and became a self-fulfilling thing. Oh, wait, what do you mean? Wait, in a good way or a bad way? Like, they started doing shit like that? Because the thing is, we're not going to... We're not... 
Cecily's too stubborn, Chad Baby Doll. Yeah, Cecily's too stubborn to be a self fulfilling prophecy. Far too stubborn. Um, who was I trying to telegraph to at all? Wifey. Oh, in a bad way, really? Nah, we're not gonna. We're not giving into it. It's been six months. We've we've lasted this long. We can keep going. And remember, if KG shoot us down, wah, wah. Wow, okay, it's very rare that none of them get back to me. We've come too far. <laughs> well, that's the thing. I was like, no, we can't die over such bullshit. <laughs> We've come so far. She's done, do you know what? I I thought she would be done. Like, the minute we met Jack Kettleman and he was threatening to throw us off of things, I was like, we're, we're done for, we're donezo. And Cecily's gonna die in the next, I, I think I gave her like two weeks. And she just keeps going, like every life-threatening situation she's been in. And let's be honest, there's been a lot of really life-threatening, like, situations. But she's just, it's just not happened. And I'm, I'm a bit thankful for that because it means her story has developed into something so, it's just so drastically different to, to anything I could have predicted. But yeah, we've come too far. I want to set up the manor. I want to get the manor up and going before Cecily dies. Like, I want it to be a self-sufficient thing. So that if Cecily does die, it will keep going. Like, I want to I wanna create a legacy there. I think. Like, at this point, we're six months into this girl as a character. I think she needs to start... She needs to get an achievement and then she needs to die. Or maybe not die. Waddle up into the distance and find... It her brain cells. Swamps mean fucking cougars. It got me last time I was here. Maybe. I think... The thing is, Chad Baby Doll, it feels like drama. And for Cecily, if it feels like drama, if it smells like drama, and if it looks like drama, then it must be drama. And we're not interested. Like, we're, we're really anti the drama. It's 100%, yeah. We're not, it's not our business. Do you know what Mills is handling it? If it becomes our problem, if someone makes it our problem, yeah, we'll approach it. But you know what? It's not being made our problem, so. Like, I don't, I'm not. Cecily is in too precarious a predicament right now. The, the manor is so fragile in these early stages like we are trying to build its foundations right now and if we fuck up here it's never gonna get off it's not gonna go further like it's it's done so 
It's pulled out of thin air as if a drama magician drama. Fucking hell. Yeah, it's it's nope. We're not we're not approaching it. Cecily's out e five thousand from it. Unless of course more information is given to make it her problem. Except for she probably should try and find out about it, shouldn't she? No, she shouldn't. This is the thing. Her goal right now isn't to go and deal with other people's problems. Her goal right now is to get her own thing up and going. And then she can deal with other people's problems. If and should they ask her to. She is a businesswoman now. To be fair, getting dragged to a secluded location over it like that is a kind of a problem. Yeah, that's true, but here's the way I see it. She was given a horse to ride off. They like there was there was no danger. The only gun that was pulled was pulled on Murray. Um, it's a shame that Murray doesn't talk. Like turn around and had told Cecily that he doesn't talk much, and then was quite happy to be chatty with the other person. But I'm like that's fine because Cecily's name is Mud. Not even Mud. Cecily's name is shit out in the West. So. I can imagine her saying, hi, I'm Cecily Caldwell, or happily, is just going to make a lot of people, like, close off. And that's fine. Oh, you think he was being like that because of this situation? Maybe. Nah, Cecily's just like, leave me out of your problems. Like, if I can't supply you with... Thing. Like, if I can't give you supplies, and if I can't offer you some sort of, like, actual decent service, um, I'm not interested in your dramas. Because the one thing Cecily would never do is say, what did he say it was about the West? It's, it's fallen? No, the only thing she's ever done is sent Jack a telegram saying that the West needs him back, and it's not the same without him. Bondu. Guess we're going back to the manor and writing in the back room. Is everyone like just dead? <laughs> they at least do the courtesy of not pretending to be nice to you before threatening you. No one threatened me though. Like, Cecily wasn't threatened there. They basically just went, do you want to tell us about a prophecy? And she was like, eh? No, I wanted to tell you about Edgar. I wanted to tell you about the good, cool thing I've done for you. You felt threatened. I didn't feel threatened. No, I. so I didn't feel threatened because if that was the case, I don't think Alice would have asked her to come and get on the horse and ride there. I feel like... And, and this is because this is what Cecily believes they do. She believes that if they have a serious issue, if they are intending to hurt you, they will just ride out and hurt you. They're not going to be like, let's get, get on the back of my horse. Let me ride you somewhere. Like, they they would just, they'll just fucking do it. So I, Cecily's always believed with them that if they're asking to speak to her, it's either because she can help them in some way or because someone's caused some sort of bullshit and she needs to say no it wasn't me like this is like the fifth time now i swear to god fifth millionth time now that cecily's just had to be like no it's nothing to do with me but thank you for thinking it was oh, i didn't grab a gold pan that's a shame My people? Where's my people? Uh... Hello, hello! Again. How's everyone feeling? Well, I'm pretty tired. Two hours looking for uh, 
We found the Alki. Next, but he did. He came back eventually by himself. Oh, he did. And he yeah, fell asleep he in sleeps. that field. He's asleep now. Oh. Right. In a field? No, in the manor. Oh, right. Oh, okay. But he did fall asleep in that field. I knew I wasn't going fucking crazy when I saw him just disappear. Right. Oh, well, I mean, I assumed he'd hit his head being the piss head that he is. Right, okay. <sighs> and he's asleep upstairs. Mm -hmm. He's asleep upstairs. He just said, uh, sorry, everyone was looking for him. He didn't mean it. He just needed to uh, rest his head. Right, okay. Fair enough. Give me a minute. I just want to get lungs into my breath. I'm like, I know when you hold your breath for a long time. I've been doing that mm -hmm. again. And then I, you right. you I refrain from killing somebody today, breath. CC. Hmm. I said I refrain from killing somebody today. Oh, was it Dex? No. Oh right. Who did you refrain from killing, and what's happened? Big brother. Then. <sighs> What's happened? Pete or something? Yeah, Pete. Yeah. Who? Some fucking fruit salesman. Ah. Little fucking cheeky prick he was. He came barreling out of the stable, like the stable doors, and turned right immediately and barreled into me and Indy, like Jesus the fastest Christ. you could go. Well, I'm 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 proud of you for not killing them. Well, yeah, my horse potentially is dead. So yeah. Oh no! Wait, really? Yeah, really. Yeah. Right. Well, then we'll send them the bill for the. No, no. The, he. The I told him because he tried to offer me fruit. I was like, I don't want your goddamn fruit. I want you to pay for my horse. And he's like, Well, I ain't got no money. And then he just started telling me I have an attitude. Yeah, and then as he was running away, slowly I pulled out my gun and he shit himself and fucking broke Wait, it. sorry. He so told you you it. had an attitude. Yeah. He's like, Oh, well, she's got quite an attitude, doesn't she? When I went to yeah. go check on my horse. You know, there was there was little, 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 little fucking part of me that wanted to send an arrow flying after as he was running away, but to be honest, she just downed his horse. He ain't fucking locked mm. in. He's not from Basel. Oh. Mm mm mm. But yeah, so we nearly had a fight with him. Then we went through St. Denis and it was dusty as hell. Yeah, we walked through all the streets there. And there was gunshots there. and all manner of stuff. So we just left St. Denis. Yeah, there's a gambling tournament going on there right now. And probably a lot of unwanted guests is my guess. Thank you, Joby! Fucking Joby, where the fuck are you right now? You've been, you've been happy panicking. Right, okay. That explains something right? about all that gang warfare, so. Ah, oh, right, interesting. That'll be why Mills Alice, that's what they're planning. Interesting. Huh? 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 Say it one more time. Huh? Uh, interesting. Oh, I thought you were seeing something after that. No. Sorry, I'm enjoying some fruit. Well, I'm did you stop buying that fruit salesman? Is my. Mm. Am I hot miking? No, I'm not letting the melons in these shot go, go to waste. You know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They're begging to be shot. Mm hmm I like those melons. Am I hot, Are you putting your head down, Indy? <laughs> Fuck's sake. Damn, I'm putting my head down now. I'm exhausted. <laughs> oh, good night, everyone. Good night. I hope you have a good sleep. No, no. <laughs> you do. All right. Uh, rest Indy. well. Indy. You too. Don't. Indy. Are you going to tackle me? I'm thinking about it. No. No, yes. Oh, ah! oh, oh. motherfucker. I'm gonna kill you so hard. Yep, Where's yep. my knife? Stay on the floor. Stay down. Stay good, down. Good. Stay down. Like the dog stay down. you are. Oh, stay down. Where'd he go? D away from you, you pretend. There's blood in Run! here. Wait, what? What? Where? On the floor, don't you see him? What? Oh. Uh. There's more here. 
So there was three ladies here before we got here. Oh. Do you think it's, you think it's Dex sleeping on the couch? Uh, Why the fuck would Dex be bleeding? I mean, he did come from a place we have no idea where he's from, and then he just went to bed. I hate you. Um, maybe I'll sleep in the other room? Mm-hmm. Sorry. I'll sleep in the room with a hole in it. Is that okay? Mm-hmm. You'll be snuggling with Todd. <laughs> I mean, he looked oh. alright when he came back. Uh, yeah, I hope so too. Have a good sleep. You too. Well, he's a big boy. He can do with whatever that is in his own time. Mm. I'm not going to wake him up just to inspect him, and I'm not going to do it whilst he's sleeping because that's weird and creepy. No. That, yeah, that, mm, that'd be an interesting fucking well, wake up. Not be him because, um... Jesus. Jesus. Everything also, all right. I also, I would like to point out that, uh, you know, on this, on this side here, with the broken window, on this side, you can mm -hmm. actually get on, like, the little railing roof there, and you can see, like, a lot out there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So if there's anybody ever sneaking, it's a good place to look out, and they might not see you right away. Your hat's on the ground, Sissy. I wonder why. It, I wonder why too, actually. I wonder why too. Yeah, that's what I thought. <sighs> mess with dangerous women. Declan. <laughs> I'm trying to mess with you. It is a pretty dangerous game, really. It's trying to mess with Indy. Listen, you don't want to know how many times Indy's done that to me. Oh, I'm sure he has. Oh, right, well, it's nice to know Indy's having fun. Mm. Okay. Oh. Declan? Declan is a friend of Myrtle's. Uh, we met him up in the snow once. He's alright. So I tried to talk to Dex. Oh, right. Um, I did tell him that, you know, don't go off doing that to us, because if we really need you, you know... <laughs> Things are going to get hot here at some point, and we're going to need to really pull together and, you know, stick with each other. And it's <sighs> so a little bit of back and forth of him feeling sorry and all this stuff. And I told him, I was like, well, we're supposed to stick together through all this. We got to, you know, we can't have you wandering off drunk and us all leaving what we're supposed to be doing and going to find you. And he said that he felt bad because he's used to not being cared for and people paying attention to what he does. Um, Declan pointed out that, you know, shouldn't, um, feel like, you know, you feel bad for yourself and stuff like that, and he said, um, God, I'm having trouble thinking right now. Can you help me out, Cat, with that conversation? So, it was, yes, yeah, so we invited him along. He was invited along to go, we, we, we were gonna go mining or something. And you know, he was like, no, no, I shouldn't do that. No, I'm sorry you all came up to me. No, no, and his ball of self fuck pee. And then Declan here was like, look, the question was an invitation. Don't feel like you're imposing. In which she was still, you know, fucking going on and on. And then I just turned around to him and I went, look, Get yourself some food, get yourself some water, and then fucking come back out of here. Come with us, it'll be a laugh. I was like, no, 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 and I went, fucking go get some food, get some water, come back. Not messing about. He's like, all right, yeah, no bother. And he's fucking went off to bed, ain't he? I tried to get him to understand that, because he did mention, he's like, well, yeah, I work here, I know how it goes. And I said, no, Dex, you don't work here, you live here. With all the rest of us, 
We have to look out for each other, so of course we went and looked for your ass while you're drunk. And I tried to let him know that he's not exactly clean. And if somebody wrong picks you up, you're going to be in a lot of trouble. He seemed to understand, but again, I don't know him that well. That kid has demons. That yes. he is really, really struggling to fight. Well, we all have demons that we struggle to fight. Unfortunately, I don't think he's quite... Um, no, not me too, just thinking. To put it kindly, he's not as mature as he probably expects him to be at his age. I don't think he's seen enough of life. Well... Actually, uh, he spent a good few years hiding out in a remote hole somewhere in Tumbleweed. He hasn't actually been about society for a while. That explains it. But he used to work alongside the dock, so I, I he believe was he's hole? competent. I'm pretty much sort of hiding, living out, probably in a mine somewhere. I'm not quite Toby sure. Toby became a hermit for a bit. They were very, very wanted once upon a time. And when the new, I suppose, when Law decided to renew all of their storage options, they were able to come out of hiding because they're finally clean. But I think a lot of their old gang were hit with a death sentence. I'm not really sure if there's that many of them left other than Doc and Dex. Well, he has enlightened me into some of his issues, but at this time it's not really my place to be, you know, sharing his yeah. issues when he's told me not to, so. I find it very interesting that he's divulged those with you, actually, but that's neither here nor there. Sometimes it's easier uh, to tell a stranger something than it is to tell your closest friends. Much. Yeah, pretty much so. Someone who has nothing to lose nor gain from the information given. Sorry, I'm doing that thing where I'm just not breathing again. Oof. You need to breathe. Ooh. No, well, I am obviously breathing because I'm not dead, but no, you just it's shallow breaths. And what I need to do is really fill my tired? lungs every so often. Me? Oh, I'm always tired. And it's my secret. <laughs> oh, I am a permanently exhausted time. potato. Mm. I don't know about potato, but yeah, permanently exhausted for sure. <laughs> I'll be a tomato, you can be a potato. Tomato, tomato, potato, patata. Yes. Patata? Patata. Patata? Patatas. <gasps> no, oh, no. Patatas. Mm. Stop talking about food. And he brought a pizza. Oh. Oh. We found out that Myrtle's a villain. <laughs> Myrtle's a villain? Every what? now and then she likes to put fucking pineapple on a pizza. <laughs> There is hey. nothing wrong with putting pineapple on See? a pizza. Oh, you're one of them as well, yeah. Mm. Oh, we I, are gonna fall out. I don't mind the flavor. I don't. There's just something about the texture when you like put the pineapple in the oven. And yeah, there's a lot of things that people, you know, put up with because you know of the texture, but they just deal with it. <laughs> oh, mushrooms mm -hmm. are one of them. I'm just not fan of mushrooms. I'm just trying to ignore I'm trying to ignore this dirty conversation. <laughs> mushrooms are one of those for me. I'm not a fan of mushrooms. I love mushrooms. I like mushroom mushrooms on my pizza with the pineapple. Mm. What the fuck is wrong with you? Well there's some people that, you know, just you know, power through anything that comes to them. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. 
I'm trying. I'm, I'm, my my, my, my mind went to fucking Kerrigan's cream is what that went to. I'm going to keep my mouth very shut. I'm trying my best the Lord to Huggle be a very the cap. outstanding We're very gentleman. And this is not the yeah, sort of conversation that we need to be having ever. Horrendous jokes would be my just strong to corrupt my soul, and I'm not a fan of that. <laughs> Listen, I spent too much time up at Wapiti. I can Speaking already tell. Repeat, you don't you have a romantic pursuer up there? Fucking two crows, yeah, two crows will hit on any man. Well, mo most men, most men. Do not, not introduce me to two crows. <laughs> I feel like I should. Do not. It really weirds me out when anyone hits on me. It's really fucking weird. No matter who it is. And the amount of fucking self-restraint to not jokingly start flirting with you right now. Oh no. No, because I would, the, I the, thing do it. Is, the thing is, I know you're doing it purposely to try and warm me up. It's a different thing. When someone actually meets it, it's just a whole hell of a lot worse. Do you not find yourself that appealing or something? Oh no, I'm just fucking mentally deranged. So it's just... Quite funny when anyone <laughs> when anyone tries to uh, massive, hit massive on me and then they realise how there, fucking no idea. Wow. weird I am. <laughs> 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 oh, fuck's sake. Oh, fucking hell. Fucking stop. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I think guys, I think we've gone for gen well. degeneracy hours, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna... It's fucking Myrtle starting to make puppy noises again. <laughs> Jesus Christ, these people. We're, we're gonna, I think we're calling it there, because this is just oh sheer <laughs> lunacy. Let's... <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Let's go say <laughs> bye to. We're gonna go. You guys we're gonna go, we're gonna go to Kettlebird. I'll never do. That's, that's my fucking problem. What's your stuff? What's your stuff? I'm, I'm just going to sleep like with my guy. Yeah, because she's keeping me thinking about breathing. While she's crying with her stuff. Fucking Jesus, she's wet. Oh, my face hurts. Uh, I won't be on tomorrow, I don't Christ think, but I will be on, on Tuesday. <laughs> so, we'll catch you then when we try not to murder the entirety of the, <laughs> the matter. <laughs> Love you, miss you, bye. <laughs> 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 ah. <laughs>